I go by the international name of Damo, never been a lame O. What's going on, family? It's your boy, King Lamar. This is Jay Willard, the podcast killer, a.k.a. Podcast Poppy, a.k.a. the Pie Father. And this right here, this is Willard Wednesdays. Mm. Brothers and sisters, you about to get some ghetto news from your relationship guru. <laughs> Yes, yes, I, yes. I pick yes, and choose yes. when I want to shoot at the camera. I mean, I respect it. <laughs> right. Thank you for participating. Today. I'm a, I'm a appreciate debatable it. shooter. I can't shoot every week. Uh, listen, I appreciate listen, it. Listen, I gotta I'm keep it funky. I'm gonna say me? this. I normally we do, well, we normally spark it with with how was your week, but right now I don't give a fuck how your week was. Damn, because Damn, we you got like us. The, yeah, no, we actually, got, yo, we got somebody that's very important sitting here right mm-hmm. now. Right, fuck my week. Yeah, we got somebody that's very important to here that right true. now, all right? And he the trumps light. all y'all week. I'm sorry. The Damn. light skin assassin. <laughs> I mean, it is what it is, right? The Shoot, beige, everybody. The, the, the beige bandit. The, Damn. What? You want wow. to slap him now? Don't stop. Keep it going. <laughs> I'm losing listen, these. Listen, for those who don't know, for those who do know, mm-hmm. for the viewers and listeners of Willow Wednesdays, mm-hmm. for the BET connoisseurs. Come on now. For, for people who just like good music. Mm-hmm. Good art, football. Mm. Indianapolis. We have <laughs> Indianapolis. <laughs> <laughs> we got Mr. Anthony Dalton the second on the motherfucking couch hey. right now. <laughs> Senor yeah. Anthony. <laughs> Yo, funny man. This is gonna be, this is gonna be interesting. But what's Appreciate the word, brother? You, How you feeling? How, How you, you feeling? doing? I'm good, man. I can't complain, man. Beautiful. I'm blessed. Yes. We like to start off by by just. Asking how your week was. So how was your week so yeah, far? Yeah. So far, man. Just being a dad, man. That's really what That's my right. main. You're a new dad. Yeah. Dope. Shout out to that. Hey. Shout out to Congrats. that. Congrats, Congrats. 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 Congrats on that. How, how, how old is he? Nine months. Nine months? Oh, wow. Nine months. Wow. <sighs> Almost as tall as you. Right? Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. a big boy. That means that means he's taller than him. That's crazy. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Unfortunately. Damn. I'll take a quick shot. <laughs> <laughs> that was good timing. Nah, he just went to the pediatrician and literally he is off the chart in height. Like he's not mm. even in a percentile. He's Uh-oh. off. For nine months, he okay. big? Yeah. And oh, he's in the okay. 90th percentile. For you think weight. you gonna get one of them like six four, six five basketball? It looks you like it, man. Oh, shit. I mean, my wife, I'm about okay. six foot, six one. My wife's about five seven. Okay. Uh, my yeah. grandfather, uh, my father's side was like six four, six five. He oh, was shit. More size 13 ring. Six. Uh, her uncle's like six six. Her dad's six. Oh, so he's gonna be a big boy. You yeah, have no yeah, idea. Yeah, yeah. yeah he's gonna be a man. Big boy. But we ain't we yeah. ain't we ain't trying to get him into college to run with a football. His right. college gonna be paid for, and if he decides, we'll take your money. Of course. We'll take the university's <laughs> money. We appreciate the donation. Yeah, we appreciate the donation, <laughs> but it. he's gonna be going to school fully paid for nice. by his parents. Mm-hmm. That's a beautiful yeah. thing. That's mm-hmm. a beautiful mm-hmm. thing. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's Liddy. How how was your week, man? Um I am debuting something today. Oh, Ooh. shit. There's no bandage. Hey! This nigga arm is out, y'all. My arm is out. Nigga, right. what? Oh, some backstory. He he damn near lost the arm about a month ago. Oh, shit. Maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe two so, months ago. But I was dragging the bandage. On, I was dra- the, the concept. I you, was, see the, you see the incision that looked like yeah. somebody sewed him up? Yeah. That has been there for about three months. Okay? <laughs> <clears throat> he bro, had the- yo, your arm is out, bro. Yeah, that's crazy. That nigga healed slow as shit. That's not no, his no, superpower. No, because no, he's it's been healed. I just been dragging when, the whole when when you when you sixty five, your skin. God, honestly, from this angle, it don't look healed. I just want to let you know. It looks bad. <laughs> it looks like it's like it's getting worse. It looked like you took the bandage off prematurely. No, but I always have. I had the bandage on for the last like for real. So you was doing months. the Allen Iverson joint? Yeah, like, I just, yeah, 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 yeah. I was acting hurt. On. I was fine. I was like, uh, yeah, I'm yeah, acting hurt. I ain't been hurt. Can I ask what what happened? Oh. Uh, literally a freak accident in the bathroom, bro. Some weird shit. <laughs> 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 hey, don't laugh. Like, no, literally. Oh, I like, I leaned on some shit. Some shit broke. Some shit scraped me. It was blood. It was like, what the fuck so is happening? you cut yourself or you broke a bone and came no, I, through? I, I cut. I got cut. Oh, okay. Yeah, nah. But you, like, yeah. Stitches? How many stitches you have? Uh... Hmm. Yeah, stitches. Nah, nigga, so. I took the skin, pieced it over. <laughs> yeah, so you need insurance to get yeah, stitches, yeah, yeah. right? So what happens is when you're not fully insured in life, take, we be, yeah, yeah. you know, you that just nigga take the skin and allow the skin to heal. No, he over just the prayed. Skin. You know when people just pray on it. He just hey, man, prayed just on gave it. Gave it to Jesus. <laughs> <That> nigga <laughs> put skin it, on his arm. I just gave it to just, Jesus. He just walked to the altar. <laughs> it's and like the next question is, did you cry? Like, <laughs> like, oh man, I can't just. You just peeled the skin back over. Hey man, listen. 
And you had a bandage. It wasn't like a cast. Or no, no, but I've been having the bandage, and that's what they've been. Every he show had a, me a, with the bandage. A gauze. He yeah. just kept reapplying. Kept re- yeah, yeah. Oh. So I just, I just let go. Three yeah. months? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Time, yeah. Time, time, time. He could have lost it. You were using arm. the same gauze the whole time? No, no a different gauze. Every time. But every time I put on a new one, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> no, no, no. no. I thought you I was that would be disgusting. I thought I saw like the same like like scratch mark on the bandage every week. All right, so cool. So you're debuting. So that's that's your week. You debuting your your arm. About your neck and arm. That's, that's the whole week. Right, cool. You sure? You, <laughs> you, you want to end it right there? How's your week, brother? What's up with you, bro? How's your week going? Um, uh, my week has been uh really stressful. Okay. Mm. Entrepreneurship sucks at the beginning. Just throw that out there. So oh, in case yeah. you gotta get the ball. In case going. you really wanna um, <clears throat> it look extravagant, lavish, but it's really annoying, mm. and your phone goes off more than a pretty girl's Instagram DMs. All right, it's just nonstop. <laughs> hmm. Mm. And that's that's, that's that's your week. All right. I mean, so you just warning people about entrepreneurship. I'm just, I'm just warning. <laughs> I'm just warning. Yes, yes. My, my week, week don't, don't get do into this shit. Listen, don't, don't do listen. It. Okay, save your money. All right, save your money. You have plenty of money saved up so where you can start the business. I mean, but you, you want to you want to tell the people about no, your business? No, it's none of your business. Okay, fine. Oh, 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 well, my business is none okay. of your business. Right. Um, uh, just truck it. Um, trucking company and uh. Blessed and beautiful luxury rentals. Nice. And nice, nice. Hmm. This close to sinking when it starts. <laughs> Listen, man. We res- right. we respect the fact that you're out here at a gotta, young age. I mean, you're doing your thing. That's that's, that's what's it. up, right? Yeah, I got a, I got a snorkeler, man. So I'll be straight. I'll be Gucci. You know what I mean? Nice. That's what's up. That's what's up. My week. Because I know y'all gonna do some bullshit, but my week was kind of dope. All right. Yeah, we don't care. Cool. So, so uh, moving on. my week, um, right? So, yo, so I'm gonna tell you. Dalton, when you I'm gonna tell you about so, my week, right? You mad fucking disrespectful. I'm, I'm trying to talk. I'm gonna tell y'all about my week. Put the mic close right? to your yo, mouth so we can't hear his then, mic. So I'm gonna tell you about my week. Hold on, right? I want to hear you. <laughs> I'm going to tell you so, about my week. But listen. Do you use a certain week, kind of like week facial dope. moisturizer? <laughs> so the reason why my week was dope, right? <laughs> my, son, my son started football. Oh, he oh, did. Yeah, yeah, why yeah. you make him start football? I, listen, I, he, I asked him if he wanted to play basketball or football. You asked him? I did. I mean, my I, mother gave I'm not me forcing no nobody to do nothing. So mm. I asked him. Well, we all asked him. Um, his uncle's in the NFL, as you all already know. Mm. Yeah. And he was like, fuck it. He want to play football. Yeah. So we actually got him on the same team that his uncle used to play on. Get the f- Wow. It's, uh, they call the Brooklyn Chiefs. Okay. You probably heard of the Brooklyn Chiefs. I feel like I have, but it's they, been a while. Eight, eight and under football team, so oh. he, he's on there. Sounds like a gang. Yeah, and he, he busting ass already. <laughs> Is he? I got videos. He's slapping niggas. <laughs> right? He, they, they had him at corner. They shouldn't have did that. Uh, he knocking everybody over. How I old love you it. Say? He's seven. He's going to be eight, but it's an eight and under. Talk team. to my wife. I keep telling her I want my son to play football. She's yeah. like, it's too violent. It's too barbaric. I tell her, I said, the people, the kids that go out there who get fucked up are the ones who don't need to be out there. That's <laughs> yes. Come on now. No, nah, because Come on now. No, no, it's the gonna, ones that so their parents put them into a sport because they want to be a part of something. So you see that kid over there just looking around and not seeing shit, and then mm-hmm. you got that one kid who's, who who's be been it. bred. <laughs> Blindsized the shit out this kid. Now he hurt, and then it's my baby, my baby. It's like, no. I told my wife, I said, we'll start him off in flag. If he likes it, he likes it. I'm not going to push my son to do anything that he doesn't want to have a passion for. Right. If he starts in flag and he's actually good, I mean, shit, he's in the ninth, off the chart in height and 90th percentile in weight. So if he starts it and he's actually a beast at it, why not? Encourage, encourage that him, yeah. mm-hmm. rather than be like, oh, I don't want you to do it because of some fear that. Yeah, it, and, and that's really just her. That's her mater, maternal. I guess you say maternal. Oh, absolutely. Instinct. Instinct. Yeah, of, no, my Not baby. My baby. Yeah. Well, now yeah. it's just because it's so people. it's so barbaric. I played <laughs> all the way till I got to college. We was gonna talk about that. And it's like the precautions that they take now. I would have had, if for offense especially, I'd have had 3,000 yards <laughs> receiving in this time period. Mm. Well, you, can't, you, can't you, touch you was a receiver? Yeah, because, right. like, the rules, like, quarterbacks can't get hit, like, one second after they release the ball. Can't touch them. You know, head, head-to-head hits. So, so you were playing until when what happened was started. Just give me the whole backstory and then catch us up to that point. Man, I... Who are you, by the way? I, I am Anthony Dalton, the second oh. actor, producer, mm-hmm. 
Uh, talking, talking. Cool ass nigga. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I yeah. mean? Yeah. Facts, facts. Uh, <laughs> you know, uh, I played football from shoot fourth grade all the way to college. Graduated from the University of Akron um, with oh. a degree in theater. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice. Um, mm-hmm. Found out that. I went to college later. <clears throat> Excuse me, actually. Um, I went at 22. You went to college at 22? Yeah, because oh, wow. I was like the popular dude in high school and everybody loved me, but Flexing my grades life, was like... Oh, got you. No, because they let me... I mean, I never got into trouble, but they kind of gave me a pass, like, mm. through. And so... Oh, yeah, we know you. We know... Yeah. You, you we know remember me. the you. We, know you. we all got <laughs> friends. Yeah, yeah. I mean... You. Yeah, <laughs> but I bet you some of them use ain't right here. Yeah. 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 You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Cause sometimes you gotta realize, like yeah. when that shit happens, like okay, they gave you a pass. Now it's up to you to make your way. That's so a fact. Mm-hmm. Fact, you know, my mom had a rule. She was like, when I didn't get to the colleges that I wanted to go to, she said, you either work or you go to school. And I ended up getting a job. I had like career jobs. I was like at a um, corporate job at like yeah. 19 mm-hmm. and I was making good money and I hated that it's, shit. It's, I woke up every day crying. Job, so. I was like, I don't know what I want to do, but I don't want to do this shit. Right, and right. so I ended up going to college. I walked on the football team That's and dope. yeah, just discovered theater, did my first play. And I was like, hold on, this shit give me the same rush as opening night of a play gives mm-hmm. me the same rush as coming out the tunnel on Saturday afternoon. Wait, so, wait, like, so, so the first time you acted in your life was in college? Yeah, well, at, in, a, in a production because I was just like, I would do impersonations and shit around my family, but I never mm. thought I'd be anything, right. you know what I mean? Mm. But college, I did it, and I did August Wilson's Fences. My first oh, play. Shit. What? And yeah, I played Corey. I played the son. Oh, you were the son? Yeah, and yeah. originally I didn't get it because I was the only light skinned nigga in the production. I was, I was, no, no, no. Yo, Dead yo, ass. I'm not trying to be. Dead ass. I saw, I saw, your, saw your wheels <laughs> turning, nigga. I saw your wheels turning. <laughs> yo, bro, I'm not going to hold you. you can see I was like, Vincent. Like, yeah, like, like you see this nigga, like, hold on. Like, what the fuck? I've seen like, the movie. Was you one of the friends? Like, one of the friends was light skinned. Was you the tree? Like, <laughs> no. Nah. Walked into Hillary. Was that nigga the, the <laughs> Was he the actual fence? No, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you the real, real shit. And this is not me being funny. We it was crazy because our school, this was the first black production mm. ever in the history of the University of Akron. All black. And but it was directed by a white woman. Oh, Shout wow, out to bro. Susan Spears. She gave me my first opportunity. Shout out to Susan. Shout Professor to Susan. Susan Spears. Uh, Susan. Uh but <laughs> but it was crazy because you know, August Wilson didn't believe in a colorblind cast. Right. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? He, it's like, no, these people are saying nigga every other word. Right. And it's, you, you know, he was from Pittsburgh. He did so, Ma Rainey's Black, Black Bottom. Black Bottom and all that. You know what I'm saying? Jitney, yeah. all that. Mm-hmm. Um, he but he, like, she did this and, like, acting um, students were, white acting students were saying, like, yo, this is bullshit. We want to audition. And she was like, no. You really want to audition saying the word nigga every other, you know, and pl- like, come on now. And so I originally didn't get the role. Uh, and Wait, the what? woman told me, <laughs> the woman told me, Susan Spears, she said, you had a great audition. And it was fucked up. She said, but you're too good looking. And I was like, what? Wow. And I told my mom, I was Yo, going to the I've library. Been there, bro. I, <laughs> you been there? <laughs> you, you feel the pain? Like, oh, no, 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 you feel that? No, no, no. Oh. You probably don't get it. It's hard, <laughs> okay, it's hard, but no, I called my mom and I was like, yo, she was like, how'd your audition go? I said, I mean, I didn't get it. And the woman told me that I was too good looking for the show. She wow. was like, what? Me and your father, blah, blah, blah. She's going on and shit. And so the guy who got the role, he dropped out. Like he oh. just didn't come to rehearsal. And so, and it was crazy because my mom, uh, she told me, she said, they're going to call you back. And I was mm. like. Yeah, oh, right. I love when moms do that. Came back. She, mm. Yeah, can you come in? I knew everyone's lines. And to this day, even on our show, I know everyone's lines <laughs> because my memory, like, I I learned. The, there was people who were in the show who were still on book, and they were, like, two, like, four weeks in a rehearsal. I knew everybody's lines by, like, the third rehearsal. All right, so I, I, I got mad questions. Yeah. <laughs> So Will Smith has some shit on the Fresh Prince mm-hmm. that while people were talking, he will recite their lines as well. Yeah. 
did you do that? Nah. So you just knew it because you you knew the whole. So you read everything. the whole script when he yeah. read the script. But I, I, my mind works like how a movie, like how you can watch a movie, a good movie, and mm-hmm. you can know like the beats and the dialogue. That's how my mind works. So I look at when I read scripts, I read it like a whole movie, wow. and I know what's happening. Like on our show, we shoot out of sequence. We shoot mm-hmm. twenty two episodes, but you may your first day of production may be. Okay, we're gonna shoot episode six, right. scene four. Oh, that would piss me off. And you got to know where your character yeah, is, what happened like, before, and so it's like a big puzzle. Mm-hmm. So I've always, if I read all my shit and learn it, I know where my character is. Oh, well, this happened. Uh, the girl, she, she said she thought this and mm-hmm. this. Okay, now I know where my intent is. And so for the play, it's no different. That's I just wild. put it so, in there. That's like a, crazy. So I, if we just going through the evolution, so you started in, in college, obviously. How do you get like what happens after that? Like college, you audition just for movies, scripts. Nah, I thought I was gonna move to L.A. I wanted to do film and theater or film, but we didn't have a department for that, mm-hmm. and no one taught it. Mm-hmm. But I was like, I love movies, and I knew <clears throat> that film and television just paid more. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I. I you know, you could do a good run of a play, yeah. but I mean, and I also wanted the world to see what I could do. Cause you could do off, off Broadway, you could do Broadway. Right. Mm-hmm. And at the time, nobody was checking for going to plays like that, <clears throat> mm-hmm. unless like the real theater connoisseurs. Yeah. yeah. And so I was like, I don't know what I'm going to do. I moved back to Indianapolis, <clears throat> started teaching in my old high school Oh wow. just wow. to make some money. How old are you? <clears throat> 28. Mm. 28. How did you deal with that? What? Like going back to my own high school? When I was in high school, any of the teachers who were between 23 and and 30 who were fine, Mm -hmm. they knew that they was fine every day. Mm -hmm. Oh, he just called you fine. No, I didn't, I didn't say Yo. that. He already <laughs> Wow, he he's got phone. a wife, bro. Like, <laughs> like, spoken for already. Like, God man, damn. like, relax. I'm flattered, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm flattered, See, but... See, you turning red, damn, bro. Like, <laughs> sorry. sorry. <laughs> In another life, another world. No. He's like, if this wasn't here, boy, <laughs> relax. Okay. No, but it's the jacket for me. <laughs> 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 heard it, heard it. No, Jesus. No, what I'm saying is, um, <laughs> the, 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 just you know, how, how how did you deal with constant that situation? Hormonal youngins. <clears throat> Hormonal youngins. No, real talk. I know it's a thing. I know it's a thing. It's not word. No, real talk. When I first got there, because I had a, I had two nieces that went to to the school. Okay. So oh, when I came back, pissed. my mom was like, "Yo." These girls do not look like the girls when you went to school. I said, Mom, you tripping. I'm coming in. I came in there. First day of school. Came in. I had hall duty. Come in. My suit. Suited in boot. Yeah. Right, right, right. I'm right. on some Joe Clark lean on me type <laughs> right. shit. I'm he like, he was a straight principal. face. Like, yeah. yeah, I ain't taking no shit. Like, you go to jail. Like, yeah. I got to let motherfuckers know <laughs> who I am and what I can do if some shit go down. Look at high school. And I'm like looking. But these, I remember these girls. They were walking. Three of them. And they walk by, not straight face, just, they walk past, the girls said it loud as shit. They said, God damn, who the fuck is that? <laughs> Girl, I fucked the shit out of him. Yo, wow. oh, when I tell you, oh my God. when I tell you, my God. face was like, oh, oh, oh my God. Because I didn't know how to take, I'm like, because first of all, they did not look like Right. Juniors, seniors, right. sophomores. They look twenty. They, they look, look yeah, like they yeah. taught it that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, mm-hmm. "Yo, how do why?" And yeah. then, and then wow. I coach girls basketball. Oh come on! Bro. Oh come my on, fam. god! You gotta stop! Like, who told you, you was to the do girls that? Girls basketball. I needed coach? money. I was trying to move to L.A., yeah, bro. Get, that was a it. choice. <laughs> I, I was trying to bounce to L.A., man. And hey, like, but here's the thing: yo, use what you got. When you a coach. It's, it's cute in the first. Yeah. You you oh that's Coach Dalton. Uh, yeah. Make their ass run, and oh, you yeah. actually become a coach. Then they hate yeah, you. Fuck Coach Dalton. The friends yeah. would be like, "Ooh, you get to be with Coach Dalton." Man, fuck Coach Dalton. Yeah. Coach yeah. Dalton ain't shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I gotta <laughs> ask for the record. Was, was it was it a good team? No. Mm. We had a lot of we had a couple of girls who were academically ineligible. 
Mm. And a lot of the varsity coach took most of my freshmen that were nice up to varsity. So, uh, okay. but he let them play when we had our tournament. You had a he let them team. play. Yeah, we okay, had a freshman team. Mm-hmm. So, All right. yeah. So I wish cool. I would have let them girls who we rocked out with the whole season play, but I tried to take the girls from varsity and we still got rolled in like the county. <laughs> like we got right, rolled cool, by a cool, team cool. of five white girls. Damn. Damn. Just five, five white, white girls. girls and we had a team of 12 black <laughs> sisters. Oh, wow. We got our asses kicked. That's, 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 that's not usual. It's um, not. That's, they that's were just not fundamental. They were that Indiana bad. basketball, bro. Yeah. Like, oh, my God. Yeah, it's Indiana, Indiana basketball. Indiana basketball is different. It's like Texas football, yes. high school football. Mm. Indiana basketball, you'll see crowds <sighs> yeah. like you would see at an NCAA game. Yeah. 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 No, it's like, no. it's like it's New York. Pressure. Is like the Mecca, mm-hmm. but like the home, like a lot of y'all niggas ain't going to be on the court shooting in snow. Yeah. Niggas in Indiana are shooting in cornfields. Mm-hmm. They parking, they driveways, I'm- the court, rain, snows, every, any, all of that. Yeah, New York, New York got real pretty. I'm not going to hold you. Like every everybody. Y'all got good pretty. players. But we pretty. But y'all teams as a whole, I'll oh, take an no, Indiana no, no, team no, no, no. over we any pretty. high school yeah, team. Yeah, so we're we pretty. We're, we play ball pretty. We're very flat. Like everybody, yeah, it's a flash. there's a point guard. Everyone's a guard. Yeah, from it's real. From they point guard seven to eleven. <laughs> Facts. Why are you handling the ball yeah, like listen, that? It's pretty. Everybody. There's no. Well, when I was the most recent one in high school here, I believe. Um, there is no. Post up. There's no. There's nothing. He can't help himself. He can't. I'm sorry. He can't help himself. Damn. The old jokes. You always high fiving yourself like for some reason. <laughs> Isn't it a curfew though? Like you, you gotta be. Oh, uh, he's with adults, so oh, you can uh, you can okay. stay out. Where well, uh, we signed a slip. We signed a slip. No, you signed a slip. Signed a slip. Got a permission slip. Stay out. He's good. Oh, he's so good. I said I could be with Jay today. Yeah. He's good. He's good. Nah. So. So every once you get the ball, face the basket. Everybody's a guard. But then, mm-hmm. then we see um, then some college team recently where there was like four or five guards, four guards on the court, and they killed. That's all I was talking to you. Um, Saint Joseph, um, the the school from Jersey City. That's what we talking about. Well, because they got to get out and run, like. Yeah. You because you, know you can't make substitutions. And they took turns. <laughs> yeah, killing. you can't make substitutions Baylor. if you got defense. Baylor, there you go. What do you, yeah, Baylor's whole team was guards, and they was smoking everybody. Yeah, mm. like they smoked the entire NCAA. They looked like a New York basketball team. Mm. Yeah, they look like a New York college. I love New York basketball, team. but as far as like, like um, we don't have a shot clock in high school, so you have to work the ball around. So we're taught fundamentals. There's no yeah. shot clock. No, so you'll see a game. We don't have a shot clock in high school. You know, you'll see a D- game damn, like I'm that. Oh, I forgot. I'm like shit. Right? <laughs> as yeah, I said, you, I'm the closest one to high school. Oh, Why you look at the camera? As <laughs> far you like, ladies, do I look at the camera? <laughs> Young niggas. You feel I'm me? Next. <laughs> These niggas. That am I. You know what I mean? Old. Me. <laughs> Youthful. Spry. Yo. I got time. I got time. Fertile. Oh. But all right, so 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 run it. So you were you 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 went back, you taught in the school. Yeah. Um, yeah, I got killed in basketball. <laughs> what was what was the next step? Yeah, like, the next, like two, three. I guess we're trying to figure out the steps to get. You okay, know, so what's next on some real shit. Like I've told this story a thousand times, but I'm gonna tell y'all real quick. I'm gonna make it fast. Um, I was back home at my living in mom's house, and I was doing laundry one day, and Tyler Perry had a. His movie, I think, Temptation was out, and every okay. time he put a movie out, he mm-hmm. would always. Uh, do a talk show with the cast and um, I'm doing laundry I'm folding clothes not paying attention and it's on it's on the TV and I'm just like all right. everybody used to say you look like one of them Tyler Perry niggas who could be in one of his movies and I'm like mm-hmm. yeah all right. and so he looked at the camera and he said I don't care how stupid somebody says your dream is go after it I am a living testament to that and it was like a trance took over me and I was like Wow. I went next door, knocked on my mom's bedroom door, and walked in. I was like, I'm moving to Atlanta, and I'm going to work with Tyler Perry. And mm. I walked out. And my mom was like, what the fuck are you talking about? What? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that was oh, just yeah, so yeah, random. Yeah, 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 bring it back, bring it back. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, that's wow. when she was like, what? Hey, you better fold them clothes. And, <laughs> right. <laughs> did you finish folding? <laughs> <laughs> I did, but I was just like, I don't, I did, but I was just, it, but I'm in there folding like, what 
the fuck did I just say? Yeah, I don't yeah. how. Yeah. And I didn't know Atlanta, Atlanta was going to be right. what it was. Okay. I knew everything was L.A., L.A., L.A. Right. I was saving up to go to L.A. L.A. And I said, I don't know. I said, I need a date. I prayed for a date. Mm-hmm. My grandfather's birthday is on uh, New Year's Day. So we always celebrated his birthday when the ball dropped. Right. Okay. And so I was like, all right, cool. I'm going to leave on the second. So mm-hmm. I'm going to be here. For Pop's bir- uh, birthday, and and I'm going to leave on the This second. is what year, if you don't mind us? 2010. Okay. Wow. 2010. That's what's happening. And man. I packed up my, I had a 97 Oldsmobile Aurora with a busted side I mirror. I love the Auroras. Yeah. Well, back in the day, if you had an Aurora, Aurora bro, nice. like, you could pull them. So, like, we, you could pull we're, them. We're had the jaw. <laughs> so we're pull older. Them. Yeah. I'm, we're older. It was, the Aurora it, it, was dope. I looked at you like, you know what an Aurora is? <laughs> yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew you was about to have a young moment. I knew yeah, it. I was the weird. young was like, moment. The young, young moment. moment. No, because I was like, was that a Maxima? No. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Auroras were shit. Aurora was nice. Like, Aurora. You, you was on some paid and full shit in a, in a Maxima type oh, shit. Okay. Like, no, Aurora was like, Deep my shit was like, it was like Pearl and it looked like, I used to call it the yacht. So it looked like a boat almost, like as far as like so how sleek it is. Boats and hoes. Boats and hoes. <laughs> boats and hoes? Gotcha. Wow. Boats and hoes and put that bitch on a. Oh, oh God. God. <laughs> they gave me they 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 I shouldn't be this excited. <laughs> it's really hype, I'm they, mad at they that. gave me they told me yeah as, we're as here you now. I understand that you know there's a particular word that we're not allowed to say on this particular show. Oh show. that? Yeah, you got to drink some nasty shit. Yeah, you got to drink some nasty shit. Hey, 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 hey. If you got to support Russia. You gotta drink some now, no, 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 no. Um, oh, Ukraine. That was a lot. <laughs> he said, oh, are you crazy? <laughs> I'm going to tell y'all something that wait, I found no, out. No, 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 wait, no, no, no. Heard- <laughs> you missed his face. He said, oh, you crazy. <laughs> 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 you hey. Oh shit! But I, I want to. I want to say this. I've been making fun of uh, gangster. It's actually not that bad. Hey. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hey, oh, bro, we got the there. shot. Nigga, he's an actor. He isn't pay right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, like we're the, sponsored, but no, 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 please, not that shit. We, <laughs> no, no, no. But I found out, and I wanted to tell y'all last week. This is actually made in Ukraine. Get the time. fuck out of here. Bro, Russian vodka made in the Ukraine? Yeah. Wow. I, I mean, that actually does it's technically actually make Ukrainian sense. Ukrainian vodka the whole time. I That's had no Ukrainian idea. vodka? The whole time, bro. So, so we just been calling it. So, so we've been supporting it? We've support. <laughs> you know how cool, you see how fickle? Yo, power to Ukraine, you heard? <laughs> Yo. Yo. Power to Ukraine, bro. <laughs> 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 you heard? I'm with you, Zelensky. Power to Ukraine, you heard? That's what I'm saying. Power to Ukraine. You right, so. They need somebody from New York, like real New Yorkers, to run for office. I would watch every debate. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Right, so tell me how you even plan to even get that shit going. How you even know that, fam? No, like, like, how you even ass know? Bugging, you even know? Dead dead ass? Ass? I looked at the statistics, my boy. It's not even working like that. Get the fuck out of here. Get the like, fuck out of here, nigga. Oh, nah. shit. Nah, nah. Suck wait, wait, my wait, dick wait. for my Secret wait. Service pocket, yeah. right? Yeah. Like, I'm not going to hold you. I'm not going to hold you. That sounded amazing. Yo. You did a good job. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to lie to you. That shit was perfect. He amped me. Y'all niggas got out? Like, yo. Nah. I was joking. Shit, There's man. nobody here. Y'all about to be like, yo, motherfucker. Like, yo, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this. We, we, we going to. One thing we like to do is, is fuck Anthony Dalton, the second Calvin's <laughs> character, right? Right? Fuck the character. Okay. Right? We, 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 I didn't know where you were going. I, I didn't like, know either. No, no, bro. You know what? It started weird. I didn't know it. It's three of y'all, but I can fight. Like, real shit. I was shit. awesome. Like, I was hey, awesome. Hey, Damn, hey, like, hey, like, like, I got your back, One thing we like to do is... No, no. One thing we gonna do is fuck Anthony Dalton. Sir, I can't. It just came in weird. I can't wait to clip that. Sir, okay. No, but Jay, it came in weird. Cool. So no, it did. So can I? It's like cool. Can I? I'm gonna zoom in on Ed's face. It's cool. Can I explain? Because I was like, I was like, I think I got his back, but I don't know. I was like, can I explain? I'm not helping him forget it. Stupid, bro. One thing we don't want to do is have. Calvin up here being uh, all Calviny, uh, if that makes sense, right? Said the forbidden word, so we go. No, we know that's Ant. No, it's, no, that's Ant. It's AD, D, bro. My bad. AD, so we're not gonna do this. No, <laughs> we're not. We're not gonna keep. <laughs> it's gonna be three names between all of y'all. Ant, <laughs> Ant, who he's talking to? No, but but what happens is right. We we want to actually have a good conversation with the person, right? And yeah. not, not not what people see on TV type gotcha. shit, right? So so here on the show, we like to ask one question. Mm-hmm. One question that would let us know where you at as a human on your human scale type <laughs> shit, right? Uh, we just want to know 
what kind of porn you watch? Kind of porn, like, like Jewish kind of porn? porn do you like fat people porn? Like, that was your go-to? Like, that was your first one? Porn. Do you like Jewish porn? Do you like white people porn? Do, what, do you, you like, like fat people porn? Do you like red dot? Do you like little booty, big booty? Do you like midgets? Do you like midgets? That's not easy. Little people. Little people. Little people. Little people. If you mess with two little people, is that one big person? No, it's a half a person. <laughs> now you're talking division. <laughs> like, we about unifying. We're talking about math. Like I'm not thinking about math when I'm. You know. I'm with two little people. I'm not thinking uh, about math. Yeah. What, what, uh, one, like, you, what kind of want, porn? What kind of porn do you watch? Do you the watch? top three? Top three. What other three? three? Right. Damn, you you shit? I'm on here now. I'm on Real here now. Shit, no. I haven't watched porn in a minute. Okay. But what I, I will say is amateur. Like okay. Amateur. Ah. Okay. So amateur. we'll start there. But so amateur, amateur what? So, 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 I'm, I'm going to say, are we talking about amateur Latina, amateur Ebony, amateur Caucasian? Oh, black, black. See, my thing is this. <laughs> when you see, like, a super fine woman, your mind goes to, you really sh- couldn't, you shouldn't be doing this. Mm. <laughs> like, it's like, in your mind, like, what? You're Fine. I get, that, I get that though. Do you realize like beautiful get people get passes through life on on some real shit? They get passes. It's and so for therefore, when you see somebody fine, I'm talking it's fine like doing porn. You like and the dude who she has to have uh, sex yeah, with. Yeah, be the worst. Worst. Uh, You'll be like, come on, so man. When you, like, don't, that, 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 uh, when you said it, all I all I heard was Drake going up to a stripper like, you know, you don't gotta do that. That's <laughs> facts. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna tell you this. <laughs> no, First no, time no. I went to a strip club here, I didn't go to a strip club in Atlanta for a long time. Yeah. Like I was here, moved here in 2010. I didn't go to a strip club till 2017. Oh, Sheesh. Man, I, man, I was here to get it, bro. I respect I ain't, it. No, I get no it. Distractions, bro. <laughs> but my nigga, you got really? two. Right. So he was folding clothes and said yeah. what he was about I to was, do. I was he not never said shipper to. going to the ship club. But it was not. went to yeah. Blue Flame. And Shout out to Blue Flame. I went in there, and this was the A++++ mm. squad. Mm. And I was like, nigga. Right. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> I see, I see. what's going on. I get on. it, because at first, you like, man, a stripper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I get it. I see I, why athletes. And I I'm see like, why you. I, why would yeah, I spend any money? Why, yeah. 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 Okay. Listen, Especially if it's right. disposable income, like real if it's disposable. Disposable income. Listen, no, I, don't fucking I, trick off your mortgage. I, like I, I, no. I, I, yeah. That's what I'm. Against. But like disposable income. If you a ball player and you got X amount. Yeah, like mm-hmm. hundred mil, and you spend ten k at the strip club. I'm so, gonna say this. I was in Miami. Before KOD shut down in Miami, mm. right? I, I have been, bro. When I'm saying I was ready to trick off mortgages and rent uh. and not have a way to get back to New York, I'm also like, yo, fuck it. <laughs> he said, they they have a way. <laughs> did you have an OG? He said they deserve, they deserve it. it. They did you have a, Did you have an OG with you? No. Oh, that's where you fucked up. <laughs> I'm OG would have been like, yo, I'm in my there man, like, there's this no shit, way put, that this is. Possible. No, I'm seeing the baddest of women, like the baddest. No. And, and, and they and hanging from the ceiling. They're not even touching the pole. Imagine that a stripper not on the pole. They on the rafters in the ceiling. I'm like, wow. No, Lily, just hanging like <laughs> yeah. from the um they actual. Like take. They hanging they from doing the, some shit. The I'm like, oh, that this were is... built into the building. <laughs> they're with the infrastructure. They're wow. like, they, 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 with infrastructure. No, real shit, bro. The architects no. built them in there. Jesus Christ. That but now, okay, so I'm, I'm I'm glad we got that answer up out of you, yeah. right? Um. Here on this show, we we like we like we said earlier, we we give a bunch of ghetto news mm. from relationship gurus, right? So they've deemed us to to give relationship advice, and I don't know why they gave us that responsibility. I, I understand. Yeah. I'll be very honest. I don't advice. I don't know why <laughs> either. But they gave, they gave it's going to be that, funny, but I don't we know are why. Successful. They they gave They're, us that's the name, true. That's what they and we've been running with it, right? Okay. So we we just got some <clears throat> shit that we got to talk about today. I've saved a couple of marriages personally. Okay. I mean, you, and I, I broke some up. So I mean, it's, <laughs> that, no, it's, 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 it's the going yin on. and the yang. It's <laughs> the circle of life. Yeah, I Listen, so funny. we do got something to talk. About. Yeah, we we got, we got a lot of shit to talk about, right? Mm-hmm. right. I do want to start here because we have a a, a a very talented actor sitting on the couch right now. Mm-hmm. Um, sure. come on now, so that's light work. <laughs> um, but Netflix is trying to crack down on people sharing their passwords. Mm. I don't like it. And they, they want to come at everybody who's who does not own a Netflix account. They they coming after you. 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 Well, what, what are, you. Like, you. What, you. They, what do you mean by coming you. after you? Like, what are they? So if I got a Netflix account and I gave you my password, mm-hmm. 
they gonna come for the both of us. Yeah. What do you mean by okay? I, I, mm. What do you mean by come for the either both ban of us? you off the off the uh, the platform or you you will be suspended because I'm the one that pays and you won't. Like right. they they trying to crash. That's down. probably what it's gonna be more. They're gonna. You're gonna have to probably jump through more loopholes. Your IP address might get banned. Yeah, oh, you, it could no, be that. you're gonna have to be like submit something to where he's already a customer. They're not gonna lose him as a customer. Mm-hmm. That's just business. They're not gonna lose him. But what they will do is be like, oh, well, since you've used this, maybe your Netflix, when you do decide to sign up, mm. will be maybe a couple months. You'll be higher. Because I always yes. wonder, like Netflix was paying Dave Chappelle and them one point this million and one point that million. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh, where the money at? <laughs> where we, the money coming we from? We are all sharing passwords. Like, mm-hmm. what is the, like mm-hmm. I, I only know one nigga who from. pays for Netflix. And That's we probably all got it. why, because they have <laughs> you to, pay for it? the content. Yeah, my exes be hitting me up, asking me if I change the password. Sometimes <laughs> I be forgetting it. So when I log in, do you pay for device, it? I gotta change it. I pay for it only because of my job. My my you, job you gives, gives me free now. My wife takes care of all the apps, and that's all she has Beautiful. to take Shout care of. That's what I'm that talking about. about. There you go. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. That's all she has. And my son, but that's all she has. I have never had Netflix ever. <laughs> when a, when a, when a, like, no, but you you like, you historically you everything. historically don't pay for sites. Nothing. Like everything. I so so everything. so. How do you? How would you feel? So your whole life is made off of favors. Yo, hold me down, bro. Yo, hold me down. Your whole life is nah, a favor. Nah. But, but, but you going that's in that direction. That's, that's fucking that's hilarious. hilarious. Wait, you, you, you going in that direction, though, bro. It's only just 20 miles further in that direction. Just drop me off. Yeah. yeah, yeah I mean, yeah, you just go. I mean, I ain't mad at you. If somebody go, if you're blessed, here's the thing. If you're blessed enough to where people fuck with you enough to want to deem you worthy to, to give to them their password. password. Fine. Or you could just, just throw down some dick. That shit sound good. Oh. I mean, or you could just throw down some dick. You're right. You oh, well, it's that you, avenue. If you give some great okay. dick, you can get some Netflix. <laughs> You're in that avenue. All right. No, no, I was no, thinking no. of a, That's a his homeboy who was like, <laughs> I look out for you. You know what I mean? <laughs> Bro, I know you struggling. I seen you. <laughs> that nigga's like, nah, damn, you fucking for Netflix? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, bro, put yourself on a high. Like, <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. Disney time Plus, Netflix, start for Netflix <laughs> time yes, out. HBO Max, time out. Dick Management. We're here. All right. We're here. Okay. What have you fucked for? Oh my God. I mean, we, we shit. We keep talking about. What's the best thing? What that What have your you fucked for? Genitals have received after <laughs> like, dropping. What have you fucked for? And this for everybody <laughs> in the room. I not know this was coming. That okay. What's the best involuntarily? Reward? Like, what have you fucked for? And she was like, hmm, uh, what's your cash app? You know what? Uh, I, I just give it to you. Old lady just decided to take you grocery shopping or something. Like, <laughs> you fucked uh, for grocery. I'm definitely fucking for grocery. <laughs> fucking for grocery. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh I'm definitely taking hey. the, um, the, um, uh, was it, was it uh, the Georgia Peach? Um, the, the, the food stamp. Yeah. What? I, uh, bro, I just got here. I, I don't know what she, that is. She left the food stamp. Nah, EBT, bro. EBT. EBT. Oh, it was EBT in Georgia. I fucked for yeah. EBT. They got there? Yeah. yeah. Okay. She had they got kids. everywhere. Shorty had hundreds. To what? She had a disposable EBT like, income. I ain't gonna front. Oh, that's fire. I but yeah, I have. So you fucked with EBT before? I fucked with passwords. You fucked with passwords. Cool, cool, cool. Passwords. Because when you can see- Put that on a shirt, bro. I fucked for passwords. And then have like the Netflix, just not because it'll yeah. be signage, but wow, just like, but you just gotta like the end. Netflix bold. And, See, I can make y'all. I'll even give y'all a trick because the way you do it is what? you be like, Nigga, you she got wanna, a course? Well, no, she'd be like, well, <laughs> she'd be like, I got Hulu. I'd be like, man, I don't got Hulu. I'm like, guess you can. <laughs> Mid stroke, he mid stroke. <laughs> oh, I ain't got Hulu. Oh, got Hulu. You hey, got Amazon hey, Prime. Until hey, you meet that OG chick who be like, and you never will. Like, <laughs> exactly. right, 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 Shit, right. I need all my. I got my grandkids coming over here. I got my babies. Nah, that's hilarious. That's I have crazy. been like, damn, you got Paramount Plus. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna lie. You got Paramount, you got Plus, Paramount Plus. You are either yeah. very yeah. irresponsible with your money, and you don't give a fuck what you subscribe to, or you know exactly what the fuck is on that streaming platform. You know exactly, because we don't. Because I don't. Nah, I don't you either. on Paramount Plus. It's probably Plus. a bunch of great things. It, I think we, I don't know. I look at our TV, and one of our TVs, it's just like, it's through the internet, and you just pull it up, and all the apps pop oh, yeah, up. Yeah, and mm-hmm. I'm like. Oh, you got smart sh- TV. You, you, got a, yeah. you got a shitload of apps, don't you? Yeah. No, my, <laughs> well, my wife finds shows, and then she, like, Oh, you gotta watch this, and she'll do the subscriptions, and then she ends up probably not 
deleting them. Like, like they just stay there. They just stay right, there. Right. So it's like, yo, AD man, well, I can get a password, bro. Like, <laughs> like what's up, bro? <laughs> what you trying to do for you the got password? All the apps, my guy. Like, <laughs> Hold on, got, first of all, we just segued from <laughs> niggas was fucking for passwords <laughs> to <laughs> you. Hey, hey, yo, AD. <laughs> I'm saying. I mean, <laughs> got that AD. Paramount Plus. <laughs> I know you got it on you. <laughs> like what? We can end the show early. Yo. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Wow. Yo. All right. Let's, hey, he yo. has a wife. <laughs> I have to try to tell him. They both do. I don't know. All right. Uh, Spite my way out of here. Speaking of wives. <laughs> okay. Um. DJ Envy. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. No. Light skin people took y'all on. Yeah. This yeah. Like, like y'all light skin people been going through it. Y'all been going. You need to write a, a message in the group <laughs> yeah. chat and let them know that he's tripping. Light skinned people, be, I, I don't understand what's going on. And I don't want to make this a color thing, but yeah. light skinned people be wild. I did. <laughs> you did. I, did. I, gotta stick, okay. I gotta stick with it because I'm so far on the other side. <laughs> anything, anything that I say is like, ah, that's what he's doing. But DJ Envy and his wife, um, mm. Gia? Gia. Gia. Do you have the can Gia you, Casey. Is it short enough to play or no? Um, was she want, on the Breakfast Club today? No, yeah, so she was on the Breakfast Club um, today. Well, they aired it today. I'm sure they taped it yesterday. Well, they do a podcast uh, together. Okay. Yeah. So, but she was on the Breakfast Club today, but I think it was, she was doing a Shade Room interview. Yes. Where her and DJ Envy were talking to somebody, and right. she basically explained that um, for the first ten years of their marriage or their situation, she faked her orgasms every time. Every time for ten years. Mm. For ten years, and he thought that he was, you know, what I'm saying, laying it down, doing mm. backflips and cartwheels in that thing, but really. He ain't touched nothing. He was just moving until she was tired. Now, before we give opinions. That's crazy. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then she just said it. And he just had to take it. Like, uh, I, I, I have, once again, this is some light skin. It's, it's, it's been a, it's, no, it's been a war. It's been a war against my light skin brothers. And I got to say something, right? Shut up. No, no, it has been. Bro, we started with Steph Curry a, a you couple stand years up ago. For light people? No, I am. Bro, it started. <laughs> it, said, start, no, I am. it started with Steph Curry a couple years ago. Oh, right? with his wife. I, Aisha. I, Aisha, yeah, said, Aisha was I love my life, and he's doing everything for me. But I want other <laughs> niggas to want me more. Like he, mm. so he had to stand in front of that. And then we had Boris Kojo and his uh, wife. What he do? What he do? I didn't, I didn't I'm ripped. Look, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna tell y'all something. On. I'm not. I'm in the industry, but I don't really pay attention cool. to yeah, it. Yeah. So, so I thought you about to be like, ah, oh, that's my man's. I can't talk about it. So I'm, I'm, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. We we go muddy the waters a little bit. Okay. You know I, mean? I, I don't want you to. I don't want to fuck a potential relationship. No, nah, I, I just don't know. Don't know. Cool. So so we <laughs> gonna say it, right. So so Steph Curry, that's that happened with I Steph. I know that one. Yeah. Cool. So Boris Kojo was on. It was during like the height of the pandemic. Yeah. Everybody was stuck in the house and we were just doing interviews and everybody was mm -hmm. tuning into people's lives. Mm -hmm. Right. So he's on a live with his wife. I remember that. And. His wife literally, like, out of nowhere was like, yeah, I'm not happy. <laughs> like, I'm, 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 like, I'm just not happy. <laughs> and, but then she was like, yeah, but sis, you're not happy neither, right? None of us is happy, but we just here together because we got to do this. And that became a thing. So then Steph Curry had to stand in front of the media and, and defend his wife like, nah, she ain't mean it that way. <laughs> Yo, Boris Kojo then had to stand in front of his wife like, nah, she ain't mean Yo, it that way. We, yeah. we working through what we working Having through. Having a wife blah, blah, blah. is tough. So now we have another situation. That's what you got from that. <laughs> Bro, we have another situation. Right. DJ Envy is on the couch with his wife. Yeah. And Shorty's like, yeah, for 10 years. Listen. I ain't bust a nut, bro. Like, you know, I had no the orgasm. Denominator. Is light skin? No, I'm just white. But no, I'm, I'm not doing that. Said, oh, white. Oh, white. Oh, oh, my bad. I said that's. <laughs> I missed it. I missed it. Just be single, bro. Like me. 88 years old. Like me. I ain't never been committed. I missed the, I missed the ball. Like, <laughs> no, but. He said that's the common I'm like, why scared if, people? If, 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 we, if we are the relationship gurus and we sitting on this couch uh -huh. and we got Anthony Dalton the second on here and we, we, we doing what we fucking doing. Right. Can we, can we talk about that? Like, what's really going on? Being light skin or a wife? <laughs> no, but ju ju just to speak to it. Because he knows all about <laughs> that. No, I'm, just, I'm, I'm just saying, I don't know nothing about light skin. <laughs> right, he I knows. Know a little, I know a little bit about wife. I, I know about that. You're married, because that's true. But I grew up in the era, I don't know, maybe this is like black trauma. I don't know. But I grew, okay. I grew up in the era what, of whatever happens Excuse me, mm. at the in the house. Stay in the stay house. In house. Yeah. Well, okay. And and now I feel like more and more it's becoming prevalent that people are just 
speaking they most in the most yeah. behind the door things that I, I didn't want to know that he never gave his wife an orgasm for 10 years. I, I didn't want to know that. I don't care. I, I, what I'll say about that, I just had an interview the other, last week about this. What happens is in this day and age is you may want to be transparent because you want to help other people who may yeah. be going through something. Exactly. <clears throat> but what happened is what is happening now, people weaponize your transparency. Whew. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Preach. So when you Preach. say, look, it could be anything. It could be like, look, let's just say someone says, I was molested as a child. Mm -hmm. Some ignorant motherfucker out there will get up there and say, will weaponize that and make people who have been feel terrible. Right. Mm -hmm. The same thing as relationships. Right. You may think like it was a pandemic. People were locked up with each other. <sighs> people right. were getting the fuck on each other's nerves. So when you see a celebrity go through that, you're like, when they say, this is what I'm going through, everybody else is like, oh, shit, I'm not the only one. Right. Mm -hmm. So when they said that, they're thinking, yes, this is going to, we're relatable. But then they're like, no, you guys are, you're a beautiful couple. Right. How could you say that? DJ Envy. And then if you want to scroll back to the uh, was it Deuce and Mero when they came on there? Uh, Deuce, Deuce and Mero, yeah. yeah. and they said, like, pretty much DJ Envy's wife was there for the check, right? Mm. Mm. So this goes back ah. to, okay, you ain't had an orgasm in 10 years. Oh, you know there's motherfuckers who will leave you after the first time? Nigga. Yeah. So, Nigga. therefore, it kind of, it's yeah. to the outside ears, it's like, well, that adds kind of merit to what Deuce and Mero, what they were saying. But I would say that's that. valid. But because come on now, point. like if you 10 years, she didn't have to say that. It, she could have been like, oh, well, I'm not going to say what somebody should have said. Yeah. Yeah. Because but I'm you, not. You that. could say what they could have said. But you could say, <laughs> OK, well, I haven't had an orgasm all the time. Come on now. If you think you've been slanging it all this time. No, there's times where your wife's like, look, not I'm tired. I'm this. And that's fine. But when you say put a date on it, Facts. Right. when you put a number on it, like I think 10 the years. I've been around for 10 years. That's so a tangible thing. No, 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 no. That, like, and tangible. you got how many kids hold and on, your on. life is this? Hold that's on. First, crazy. Guys, Come on now. First 10 years. So 16 to 26 ish, 27 ish. Oh, okay. Because they met at 15, 16. They were kids, yeah. Yeah, they were, oh, they were teens. What the fuck so, does that got to do anything? No, nah, because you I'm ain't going to be seven times, Ain't going to be 16 said, having oh, orgasms. I'm served. <laughs> well, he, he, said, he said the breakfast club has been around. I just want to put an age there. Oh, okay, gotcha, yeah, gotcha, they've gotcha, been gotcha, together gotcha. since they were Sean kids. Sean Casey's in his 40s. When they're young. Also in I don't know if I came off aggressive. My bad for that. <laughs> nah, nah, I'm sorry. Nah, 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 <laughs> but, I, I, I don't know what the fuck you mean. My bad. So this is almost 20 years removed. You know what I'm saying? About 15 or 20 years removed. So I agree with him. But either way, I do agree where I was saying. What are we talking about that for? Shawty could have. Okay, country, come through. Yeah, Shout it. Shout it. Shout it. Shout it. Nah, nah, nah. I was talking to my man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shout nah, it. Nah. Come through. Shout it. You feel me? Yeah, then, then, but then, now you got to come back. Now you feel me? Now you feel me? Now you feel me? Now you feel me? Shorty, 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 shorty could have easily. Shorty. For no reason. You just got to. Shout it. Shorty. I hate you. I hate you. Yo, that ass on my dick. Y'all niggas is wildin'. All right. College Park. College Park Moxie. College Park Moxie. College, college Bush. College Bush. College Bush. College Bush. College Bush. River Bushwick. College Bush. Bush. So, no. Um, I feel like she could have... I feel like everything is how you um, present it. You know what I'm saying? So, if you present certain things in a way that can... De not demean, but put your other emasculate. partner. Yeah, emasculate. Yeah. Now that's that, but that's something that's been going that's around like. in the past, like four to five, four years. I'm gonna say yeah, it's, it's been it's extremely bold and, and 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 really just I'm unchecked of the emasculation of men and especially black men, in my opinion. Yeah. Um, mm. For a, for a long time. Yeah, of course. But very very aggressive in your face. More recently, Which, so yeah. go ahead. I say because of that, I feel like um, there's 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 ways to basically explain your situation, explain what you guys have been through, and say, hey, look, you know, <clears throat> as you say, she could have said that we really didn't know what we were doing, right? Mm -hmm. Like I didn't even know that I was supposed to even reach this point, mm -hmm. I didn't, and he didn't even know how to get me there. We were right. learning each other for like the first ten years. 
we were so inexperienced that this didn't happen. And that's a way of saying, hey, you know, this is, it was a learning process. Instead of mm. just put, outing some, Instead of putting yeah. it as, yo, he ain't know I, what he was doing. I have a, I, I have a. <clears throat> you good, bro? I don't know. I got. I got <laughs> you got that, that shit up in there. I got mini COVID. Cool, no, whoa, 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 whoa. We don't speak uh, I can't play like, I can't play like that. Nah, like no one got room, no one tested yeah. before we, right. and then you just bring me in here. Nah. Yeah. 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 Listen, all the airlines this man gotta work tomorrow. No. You understand? Y'all are here from Watts Pierre, attorney at law. Tomorrow. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? I thought we was chilling. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nigga. Nah, 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 he dropped his attorney in there. I like that. I like that. That was good though. I, I, I want to say he need more clients. <laughs> Go, ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. He got business for that man. <laughs> like, like, or woman. Like, was, yeah. No, but I I have an alternative <laughs> way of thinking, man. I, I, have, I, have, I think this was done spitefully, right? Mm. And the reason why I think it was done spitefully, mm. um, they they've had a, 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 a situation in the past that was very public. Yeah. He was um, he, fucking the shit out of Erica Mena. He was fucking Erica Mena. Yeah, we know that, right? So that's very embarrassing to that woman, right? Yeah. How can you embarrass a man uh, on national television? Manhood. It's to say that you never received an orgasm for your man. I, f- I, I don't want to... I, I don't know these people from a hole in the wall, yeah. right? I'm just making a conversation because this is a podcast and this is what we do. We're supposed yeah. to talk about shit. But I feel like she picked a very good time. Mm. I mean, and they're promoting a book. It, That's what I was gonna oh, say. She's promoting the book. It's, I got it, you. It, it's just yeah. so much shit. And yeah. to go back to the Will and Jada shit, like I, mm. I, I feel like she she wants to promote her fucking red table talk so much that got she'll you. do whatever it takes to downplay Will. And mm. I feel like here oh. she's promoting a book so much that she'll do whatever it takes to downplay her man because she has been embarrassed. Right. So she's like, "Well, you embarrassed me. I can embarrass you a little bit." And now this man has to stand by his yeah. wife. And you got, you got to sit by your wife. Yeah. And we I'll, I'll play devil's advocate because okay. I always see both sides. Of, I try to see both sides. Mm-hmm. So, this, black women have been getting shitted on by black men for a long time. True. And subconsciously, what I think is now with... Even if you go through the Me Too movement, you go through, so you, you know... All these other things that are happening right now, mm. it's like, it's subconsciously like, okay, y'all shitted on us for so long. Y'all it's our, it. it's kind of like our time. And even if it's somebody who's just collateral damage, Steph Curry is the nicest dude. Like even, and even when that situation happened, real niggas know like. It's not that dudes don't resire, desire you, Aisha. Sorry, it's because we respect right. Steph Curry. We respect dude. He a cool dude. Yeah. Like, there's right. a difference, and I've always said there's a difference right. between, and I don't want to throw nobody's, no celebrities yeah. personal yeah, shit, yeah, yeah, no, but there's a difference between that girl who exudes a certain energy mm-hmm. and her dude exert, exudes a certain energy that mm-hmm. she'd be like, Shit, if she threw it to me on a Thursday, I'm I, I, catch it. I but the thing is, if Aisha Curry came to you, this wholesome, beautiful woman whose dude is like I, I, I that, that stand-up dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's Steph. Like, it's yeah. not, and she, I damn want to call Steph and be like, yo, bro. Yo, your uh, girl, wow. Like, <laughs> your girl, you know what I mean? Like, uh, but I think the thing I mean, is time, that yeah. the thing <laughs> is, is that, you know, she doesn't get it because she doesn't walk in. She doesn't have a dude's mentality. Right. Exactly. So... For these, like DJ Envy, like you said, I didn't know anything. Once again, I we don't, don't know fuck with, we don't. I don't really deal with celebrities. My wife sometimes has to tell me, did you hear about this? I'm like, I don't know. I, I, um, I, I, but so I didn't know about DJ Envy and Erica. I, I want to I I challenge you on that one thing. You can't okay. say you on, you a celebrity, bro. You yeah. can't say you. you Yo, if a scandal come out, we going to yeah, be on like, this show. I don't talk real about myself, it. Like real you know shit, that, bro. Right? I don't. And you can ask Justin. <laughs> I really don't look at at myself as that it was like when we were hiring our nanny we had no 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 anybody nah, people nah. can get nannies don't act like it's exclusive don't act like 
Big Mama can't come nah. to your house and buddy, watch your sorry. kids. Nah, sorry, buddy sorry. ordered his no, nanny. Right, but, okay. no, but we were celebrity nanny. It was just no, funny that you we said were, it though. <laughs> we were we were interviewing our nanny and we had to Interview. talk about like the um, we were on Zoom and we were talking about like the NDA that she had to sign because I mean my wife works for a big company. I'm you're in entertainment, you. so right. scripts and stuff, right, plot right, details right. and yeah. stuff. So Got we were you. telling her, and she, my wife, had to explain. She was like, "So yeah, there, do you have a problem signing an NDA? Because my husband, and she literally, like, if you're me, she was like, because my husband is a celebrity. <laughs> <laughs> like that's because we and we right. both look yeah, like, yeah, like, <laughs> like it's <laughs> like Ugh, because I don't like saying it. Right. I don't use the. I don't go into you know who I am. No, but I, I get it though. You know what I'm saying? So it. for me, I don't really look at myself like that. But going back to the uh, these relationships, it's like black men have shitted on our the world's number one resource, which yeah. is black women. That's Ooh. a and, fucking thousand, fact. And real shit. And so reason. therefore, subconsciously, it's like it's our turn. It's our rising. And like, do I think um, Nicole Ari Parker doesn't love Boris Kojo. No, but y'all motherfuckers was in a house together for <laughs> we a sick. year, damn near. Yeah, like nice. no work. You can't go to your set. Absence makes the heart grow fonder. That, that is, is a so fact. therefore, like yeah, if you around your fun. significant other, I don't give a fuck how much you love. How many divorces happened in twenty twenty? Yeah, no, literally. Why do you think basketball players literally. rarely? It's rare that a basketball player gets divorced. You know why? Because they're, they're gone, gone. eighty two. Yeah, yeah. Why do you think Tom Brady went back to work? Exactly. No, that yeah. Yeah. Said, yeah. Yo, I'm yeah. 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 That's yeah. what yeah. I'm saying. Yeah. I'm going back to work. I don't. I don't want to. I don't. I don't like. That. I'm going back to work. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So like it's a family. Twenty years. So like these women are like okay now. The whole, you know, when you're, I, I do believe business is business, but you're personal. Like, I will never out my wife. I told my wife the other day, I said, if anything ever comes out to where, let's just say somebody records you saying some shit, like a podcast like this. We yeah, just read. Yeah. <laughs> let's like, just say niggas. Yeah, like, we just saying some shit and somebody says something. I will take the blame for it. Mm. I will be like, fuck that. You're not about to disrespect my wife. Right. You're not. I did it. I said it. Oh, right. I said that shit. Come because through. you're yeah. my wife. As a husband, I am a protector. Right. So therefore, mm -hmm. talk mm -hmm. about me. Don't talk about my fucking son. Mm -hmm. Don't talk about my wife. You can talk about me. You can say I'm not talented. You can say this, Keep that, and my other. wife's name. <laughs> and I feel it. your fucking I mouth. I feel it. So now here's the thing. When we were talking about that, uh, the Jaden and the Will situation about... Um, Protecting your spouse. Right? When did your jacket come off? I, it's been off, bro. My Where bad. Yeah, was, Where have you been? I, was, I don't know. <laughs> Where have you been? <laughs> Two seconds later. I'm drink my alkaline water on that. <laughs> I was wondering Yo, what was buddy. in there. I ain't gonna front. It's alkaline. It's, like, it's Russian vodka. Yeah, I, I figured. It's Ukraine vodka. Ukrainian vodka. Like, either he's healthy or he's Yo, what, an alcoholic. What is that? <laughs> like, was, alkaline water. Now, you brought... I don't drink bottled water. I'm sorry, bro. You can call me bougie if you My want husband to. My husband's a bougie. celebrity? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what you want. He said, I only want green skin. You know, yeah, listen. <laughs> yeah. green skin Buddy's drank only. something with two hands. I'm like, oh, no. Nah, that, that's a bottle. <laughs> you made everything. What that was about to say? And then no, chase so, it with um, this. <laughs> <laughs> so when it's we like were talking about the vegan. Jada and the Will situation about feeling like you, I didn't hear that, uh, feeling like you need to protect your significant other. Yeah. And... Everyone's crucifying Will for his decision, even which I feel like is still wrong. I brought up the fact that none of Will would have never really felt like he needs to overly express his, you know, overly protect if Jada in the beginning would have said exactly what you said about your wife. Would have right. said, yo, look, August, you're not going to, yo, media, you're not going to listen. Right. She you're never took that stance. Have you read his book? <laughs> no, I have need you to. Either really get it, either. I did. Yes. Great book. Either if you if you're not like a person who sits down and reads, just play audio. that shit on oh audio. Audio is better, what actually, if because he's reading it, and so and you can tell where it becomes Shut up, Jay. where it becomes it's emotional. It's no, it starts off where he's like you can tell he's reading it, but when he really starts diving into his real shit and tapping in, it's not even it's like a conversation. Yeah. It's it's not even reading. It's him going. It's like off. you sitting there listening to Will talk to you and just tell you right. What's up. So he said. 
you got to realize, to, for him to be the biggest movie star in the world, and I met Will Smith. This brother talked to me for 15 minutes at the Tyler Perry opening by myself. Don't know me from a can of paint. Wow, and good. just poured gems into me. And Shout to that. He, like, he was saying that, what was he saying? He said that to become the biggest movie star, I had to kiss every baby, I had to shake every hand, I had to do all this. He literally looked at Tom Cruise's schedule mm -hmm. and said, oh, his media schedule, like, oh, I'm in France and I'm going to sign autographs for an hour. He said, okay, I'm going to sign autographs for two hours. Mm. And so, therefore, he's becoming, we were talking about this earlier before we went on, to when you set a standard, the minute you become human, the industry thinks that you're, that's not you. So when you have a human experience, right. meaning everyone gets mad, everyone gets sad, everyone has yeah. a breakdown, that's right? Exactly. So when you present this united front to where your life is perfect, mm -hmm. and then that one time to where you snap or you have a human moment, well, you just fuck up. what happens, or you fuck up. Just fuck up, what happens is everybody's like, oh, Oh, it just so happened that Wills was on the biggest stage in right. white Hollywood. Right. So, therefore, it's amplified. And the fact that he did it, if he would have done it, like, let's just face it. Who's the bigger star in their household? Will. Will. Oh, yeah. So, you can't cancel Will Smith. You can't. Jada Pinkett? <laughs> You probably would have to sit down for a little bit. I mean, like, I mean, I'm, I'm, and it's no distance. No, 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 you're not. But she's not, not in blockbuster movies that have op She doesn't have Listen, the record for the longest. She's more expendable. That's what, that's what I just started looking at. I said, movie, 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 movie. Oh, she's movie, more expendable. Movie, movie. And, 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 he has the record for most consecutive number one movies. If he, if on the book. He says it. He's list. He lists he's like talking for like five what? minutes. What do you mean by record? No, for real. He, uh, he lists of off all race? of any anybody, of anybody, anybody who's happened? ever been in a movie. He has the record. So if he he'll go down the list. Hitch number one and blah 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 blah. Made this Independence Day. Blah 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 blah. Pursuit of Happiness. Blah 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 blah. Yeah. Like this nigga has done it all from comedy to animation to drama to anything. Fact. He Shots he's Mister Not I Can't Miss. Mm -hmm. Wild Wild West still made bread, but it was it just did. trash. And yeah. then the song was a hit, though. And the song, <laughs> the was, song a was a hit. That's Wild what I'm Wild saying. West. And even when he did this shit with Chris Rock, he slapped Chris Rock for disrespecting his wife, quote unquote, disrespecting his wife right. on the biggest stage in Hollywood. It's still kind of a win. Took home the Oscar. <laughs> then he partied at the Governor's Ball, dancing to his Grammy Award winning song. <laughs> He's the biggest movie star to ever grace the planet. Question. No one has ever done that. Question. Who is your, like, Mount Rushmore Ooh, actors? Good question. How many years on Mount Rushmore? Four? Four. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? You know, I ain't never been there. Like, 16. You 16. You 16. get four and a possible. <laughs> like, who? Like a spade hand? I like, like that. I fuck, with the, I fuck with four with a possible. Any, because I, I, I hear your, like, I hear the... the, the, the passion the, comes Yeah, we, zeal. I hear yeah, it. Behind the Will acting, Smith. It's like... Enthusiasm. Acting? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, who... Acting. If update with you, like, that's that. Dumb niggas is dumb They don't have to only be black. Got you. Oh, no. It's no, there was definitely my body was all there's some, black. Yeah, no, okay. there's some cats who, like, we I will say, um, right now, I can't say young boys because they still got a lot to go because there's some boys who got some heat, and I'm like, y'all gonna be great when y'all get like 30. Mm. Uh, but Will Smith, okay. Or, okay, we're talking actors or movie stars. Oh, because there's wow. a difference. That's a big, because that's Will, a I said this. I said this on Stop my Instagram. No, 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 no. Because I you said know, this. No, no, he's right. no, 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 no. There's a difference. There's a difference. I'm telling you, as I'm talking, like as far as a movie star, Will Smith is a movie star. He set out to be a movie star, and acting was his thing. Now, can he act? Clearly, but. There's cats who never have gotten a reward or don't do the numbers that he does at the box office right. who, in a scene, I feel like they will eat him up. Mm. Men or women. Men or women. Will Smith up? Yes. Who the fuck can you name? Oh, can we? Okay, before you do the name, can we, can we please? Because I've been trying to tell him this for years. Okay, please. I'm so sorry. Ba background, background, I'm sorry. Background, I'm sorry. background story. Oh, this is the old version this, of the show. This, this sorry. became a thing, <laughs> a okay. and now we are here. And, and we have someone. He's been telling me for years 
that Jamie Foxx is a better actor than Will Smith. Yeah. How do you feel about thousand that? Thousand percent. Mm. Not a thousand. Wait, let, can, no, he, can he answer the question? Y'all never asked me. I just I, I, I wanted to know. You're not a professional. I, we have a professional here. <laughs> this has been an argument for us. No, bro. Eight years? No, more than. <laughs> more. We've been arguing since the, like the first day I met this no, man. That's like, a good argument. Though. That's easy though. Well, it's not, not, it's not easy. easy. <laughs> Nothing is easy here. It's not easy. Not, what it's not easy because if you want to talk about a catalog of work. Will, got it. Will Smith has Over. never done the the route of you gotta realize Jamie did like held up. Mm-hmm. Jamie Jamie did um he's I don't know. Booty call, the dumb Yeah, he does he had he didn't have to Booty go. Booty call is classic. He, it's classic in but it's not a good movie. But it's not a good movie. But it's not a good movie. The black movies. Uh-huh. It's well he the, the lanes were different. Right. Because <clears throat> Will Smith got in the lane because he was the Fresh Prince. Right. Then he got the TV show, and then he jumped into his first movie was it, with well, oh, was was a was a critically acclaimed drama, um, Six Degrees, Six of, degrees separation. of Separation. Yeah. So like Jamie didn't go through that. Jamie went through Bruh. the his Living Color, was and though. then he got he had. To, and I'm not gonna say. I mean, it, this is an amazing argument yeah. about both of these. But they got. I always say this. There's a hundred ways to get inside of a house. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Ask the roaches. I Will like Smith <laughs> went like in that. through the doors that were open. Jamie mm. Foxx had to go he through other doors. He created had doors. But doors. Jamie Foxx had to sing. He had to do this. And he had to smooth. He had to be nice with everybody. He has to throw parties at his right. house. Get a, this. Yeah. Meet these people. Right. right? Right. So the catalog started off on a higher level for Will. Mm. And Jamie had to go through, I just need work. I just need work. And then the work started doing this. You see what I'm saying? And so, so are, then... Are you changing my fucking mind mm, right now? No, but it's just Come facts. Through, bro. Wow. It's Come facts, through, though. Bro. I'm not saying either or. It's an <laughs> argument. If you said, Will... No, I'm, 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 so when I'm he buying what you're selling right now. I'm, I'm buying what you're selling right now. Yeah. I mean, I they just had to go through he a different... You made it sound way better than you, nigga. <laughs> like, I be drunk so, and we be screaming. I be drunk. <laughs> I mean... I be drunk and yo, we be screaming. I stole $1,000. I be drunk. That's Yo, funny. Anthony. So they'll 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 give a a, a very vague question, mm-hmm. and if you be like, all right, wait, blah 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 blah, blah they'd be like, nah, it's a caveat. Just answer the question. You can't. You oh, can't. you try to make your point, huh? Uh, you can't. No, so you're you right. You trying to bring you're a caveat right. man with you? No, you, you can't. can't. You, you can't. can't. A caveat man you can't guy. because <laughs> if you look at okay, <laughs> then if that's the case, then okay, Jamie Foxx got an Oscar first, like. What? Yeah, like, what are we talking about? Okay, so, but we so, just, but we, okay, so but I, just I, skip. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just like, honestly, guys, I'm just saying, you know, for the rest of life on this show. Uh-huh. I get it. I get it. You've made your point. I get it. Gracias. But I, I, I do want to say, if, if it was just face value, right, and you had to pick one right then and there, boom, Acting. Will Smith, Jamie Foxx. Talent? But just off of nope. whatever you deem to be whatever you best, deem. Let's do best movie versus best movie. No, no, just... Yeah, do best, no, best stop caveating the caveat. Because he's, he's trying to bring a caveat. Can't do that win. because Will's got more of a catalog. Uh, and, and so he will win. That's so I mean. would be like, okay, what am I going to put Will or I'm going to put uh, Ray up against Pursuit of Happiness? Or yes. am I going to put Ray, Ray up? You, you say Ray would win on Yo, the Pursuit of Happiness? Bucking the fuck out. You're I don't know. That's that crazy. last scene when that boy broke down when they gave him the job. Hey, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. I'm. Yes. I, I now, now, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna None agree or disagree. Remember his, remember his age. No, 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 no. It doesn't matter. Like, like, it doesn't matter. Like, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna stop that. Younger. But, but so that is a hell of a battle. That's a good. That's like. Look, if you put no, really, no, because we Will Smith slaps him easily. Ray in the pursuit and the pursuit. He became Ray to the point where we forgot it was Jamie Foxx, dog. Like, like legit. Yo, bro. The nigga. Sat in a bathroom holding I his mean, child. But he ain't somebody was trying that to break that? Him the door. But he the emotion. <laughs> That's like, a script. No, so listen, listen, listen. Oh. So, so, but so, Jamie, Fox, Jamie Fox didn't produce normal. The script is the blueprint. It's what you bring to. Yeah, it's what you bring to. But he that was in a bathroom. Somebody tried to break in the bathroom door and his child. Like what? Let me bring it out. Let me break it out for you. Do you understand the level that you have to be in mentally? To be to be a blind character, and to keep to to, to, to be a great that's, method. Yo, that's a, that's no, that's no, valid. No, 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 but, nah, but, but, no but, that's yeah, valid. Bro, 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 hear me no. out. I'm not an actor, but this is that's a valid professional. Part. Understand, bro. <laughs> acting is one thing, but to act blind that means everything is muscle memory from what you learn. And he literally 
He glued his he eyelids. Really he glued, glued his eyes, eyes yeah. shut. So that he was blind. Then he played the keys. It's the facial expression. It's how he moved, how he talked. He literally, I saw them. I think I watched a documentary where I saw them together. I'm like, yo, it's like a time capsule. Yeah. I'll say this. He became there are great. very few people that were born to play a role. Facts. Like when the role comes around, there's people, there's been scripts that have been sitting around in Hollywood and the right person. You realize like Black Panther was supposed to be um, Wesley Snipes and mm-hmm. uh, Denzel Washington. Get the Who, fuck out of here. Who's going to be Denzel? Do you, do you Denzel know? was supposed to be Killmonger and Wesley Snipes was going to be Black Panther. The brothers, the brothers that did House Is Party. that facts? Huddling. Yeah. Hudlin. What? The Reggie Hudlin. Wait, wait. I, I, okay. I, I can see, 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 see that. I can see Wesley. I can see Wesley as Black Panther. You can't see it now can't, because it doesn't make sense now. It's first of all, it's 2022. This was script was pitched around before Blade. So before you know what I'm saying. Yeah, this was before. 90s. So, so, so of course, this in the nineties. Yeah. Yes. So this was okay. I'm saying. This but the thing was, say, Marvel so. wasn't Marvel like it is today. Marvel Mar- sucked during that time. Marvel like Blade saved Marvel. Yes. Like yes. that was the biggest budget that. movie or the biggest grossing movie that Marvel ever had. Other than they had like bullshit like yeah. like a made for TV shit yeah. like Fantastic Four and shit. But all right, all right. that all was. Very, that was supposed to be that, but there's there's very few now. You can't even think of anyone else playing Black Panther I besides can see Wesley Chad- Snipes. Chadwick Boseman. Yeah. I, I, all, right. all due respect to the late great nineties Wesley Snipes, I could definitely bro. See I can Absolutely. see Wesley nineties Wesley Snipes. Throw an African accent on Wesley. Yo, Absolutely, Wesley. I don't think, bro. But he ran the world at one point. He literally, yeah. like, when I look at that, I go through my accent. memory. Definitely did. Like, that man. <laughs> when I watch old movies, that man's charisma. Did. His no, energy. He's, nah, ooh, he that's what, ooh, you talk about Mount Rushmore. Let's get back to it real His quick. His charisma, before we get energy. To, before we get to a new topic. How a he topic. impacted every single movie. Literally, I want you to look at, uh, what's the no, movie, what's the movie with him and Bruce Willis? Uh, where it's like a, 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 in the future. You mean Sylvester Stallone? Sylvester Stallone. Um, Demolition, Man. Demolition, Demolition Man. Demolition Man. I want you to think he about Demolition Man. And then I want you to think about Blade. And yeah. then I want you to think about White Man Can't Jump. No, I want you to think about... White man can't jump. New Jack City. Come on, oh, oh, come Jesus on. Blade to Wong Fu. I didn't wow. see that one. I didn't see no, that one. but he did to Wong Fu. To Wong Fu, he did. played a cross dresser. Yes. So I, you went from the baddest it. gangster to ever probably grace the screen. He was also in waiting to exhale. <laughs> come on now. You gotta understand the, the range is crazy. So oh, one is on my list right now. Wesley. Let's do it. That's Wesley. Wesley. Wesley um, Will. You Wesley, Wesley Will. We know you got Will. Wesley um. Will. I got to put Daniel Day Lewis up there. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wow. No, because Absolutely. Daniel Day Lewis disappears in roles. Fire. You don't even know it's him. You forget. You don't you even know it's him. Motherfucker played awesome. Abraham Lincoln and told everybody to call him Abraham Lincoln. Do not call me. What's the name? You don't know who Daniel Day Lewis is? I think I do. Okay. okay. This no, but Last of the Mohicans. Learn this man. Um, Yo, look him cool. He played Lincoln. He played Lincoln. He played Lincoln. Remember Lincoln came out? Abraham, Abraham Lincoln. Lincoln. You he only mean? does a movie like every fucking five yeah. years. Like he, I, I, I'm, I'm I think he's retired from acting. <laughs> he's doing a me on me. See, he's doing. He just go to IMDb. Nah, but mine's more. And like, you probably won't like, even like for those who are watching who are of of particular age. <laughs> Daniel Day Lewis. <laughs> but speaking of IMDb, I definitely, I definitely jumped on your pause. I did. I was like, I don't care what he did. Oh, oh this nigga is lit. <laughs> but he was in, he was in a lot of shit, man. Hey, man. No, no, no. And you no. was a part of a lot of shit. No, hey. but you know what's funny? Yo, buddy did games in New York. <laughs> oh, now, now you, now you. He's catching up. He's catching up. Yo. <laughs> Yo, he's catching up. He killed that role. He move the he's the Meryl Streep. You know how Meryl Streep, when yeah. she gets nominated? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like, okay, everybody else is second. That's the dude version. No, so anytime Daniel Day Lewis is nominated for something, it's probably he's going to win it. Do Real you quick, this understand is, how good that. Before this yes. goes six he did ways. way better than Leo. Before this goes six ways, keep your point because I like where we're going. Yes. But I do want to finish the Mount Rushmore. Mm-hmm. You said Wesley. You said Daniel Will. Day-Lewis. You said Daniel Day Lewis. That means we give you one more and a possible. <laughs> now we have to talk about women too. Okay. Um, I'm with I that. like that conversation. We have to talk about women. So I will say. If we're talking about acting. I'm talking about like transformation acting. We have to say <laughs> Renee Zellweger. She's on there. Okay, you are going in. I love nah, it. You know he's a professional. I love it. Though. He's a professional, bro. The, he's a have professional. you seen like Have you seen, yes, uh, seen the Judy? Yes. 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 What yes. like? Yes. 
Yeah. Bro, like I'm looking at that craft. I'm talking, to, and there are so many people that can be on this. So like, it's yeah. not like yeah, yeah, yeah. it's hard for yeah. me to pick this. Um, so that's oh man, and so I, I would four, probably bro. that's four, that's fifth. three right there. Whoo, and there's that's whew. four, bro. You said that's four. That's four. <laughs> you said Denzel. Two black no, no, you ain't say no, Denzel. I didn't say Denzel. I, I'm sorry. Why you, you, putting, Will, why you putting my words bad. in my mouth? My bad. bad. Now you said Will, Jamie. No, I didn't say Will. I said Jamie. Wesley. Said Will first. I said Wesley, oh, oh, oh. Daniel Day Lewis. Oh, oh, so you didn't put Will I, on there? You I didn't yet. I thought no, you did. we were talking about Will. I didn't say it. No. Okay. Because here's the thing. He is. I'm talking about catalog, like Wesley. Wesley. Daniel Day. Because I'm looking from the whole Renee spectrum. Zellwinger. And it... Wow, that's good. It's a great It list. might be. And you said I get a possible? You get a four and a possible. You get four and a possible. You know. It's like, you that's know. like Tupac and Biggie. It's like, eh, eh, you know. Nah, nah. Nah, it's, it's but you, be, it's you know what I'm saying. Because I'm trying to break through. Because there's some people who are superstars. Like, who were movie stars. Right. Actually, but they like weren't like, like... Like, if you go back... I'm going back to like black and white and going back to oh, shit. Because like, if you're going back to like that, you can say Charlie Chapman. Charlie Chapman, he always comes up. Charlie Chapman is in everybody conversation. Let's, let's say last, Absolutely. Last, last, last 20 years. Last, yeah. 20? last 20 years. Last 20. Because it's, it's too many great people. Right. Really That's what I'm saying. Yeah, Mount Rushmore I, I, would be... I think we have to do like decades. I think we have to <laughs> okay. do... You know, so, but just in the last my four, 20, 30 years. I'd have to throw Will in there. I would do I'd Will. And as a possible, as the alternate... Yeah, yeah, the alternate switch out. Don't say Diddy. Who? Who? Denzel. Oh, I thought you said Diddy. I, I thought Diddy? you said Diddy too. Like, right? Sean like, Combs, Diddy? Like, like Puff Daddy. I'm about to say I tackle your ass. Dive over this fucking couch. Um, <laughs> shout out to Diddy. Uh, <laughs> He's like uh, that yeah. boy getting paid by Diddy. Diddy yeah, paid me. Shout out to Diddy. Shout out Right. Brother Love. Seeing that next commercial, getting on a jet. Um. Damn, the possible. Ooh. The, the, yeah, it's and you know I'm already looking black first. So of course. Yeah, clearly, I'm, I'm looking I mean, black it's, first. I, it's not, I think I it makes sense. No, I'm looking black first because there's some people that. I got one first. I got to say Viola. Viola. Thank you. Thank you. I literally was sitting here like, yo. Viola. Bro, I'm sorry. I, I know, we I know all I the same gotta gotta say This is going to be distorted. I'm have over to. here sitting like, no, yo, we, he better say Viola. Didn't no, we, he, I literally <laughs> he was, I was on, about to say Fences. I have to. Fences? I have to. We, I have to. We, we was on the same timing. I was thinking about Listen, listen. I'm not going to front. I was thinking about People, I want y'all to understand. Honestly, and I'm going to give you one more Tom Hanks. Oh, Tom Fuck! Hanks is, Tom Hanks is fire. <laughs> I think yeah. that's my guy. Ah, yeah. Tom Fuck. Hanks is fire. Yeah. Tom that's Hanks one. is fire. That's Damn it. No, see, no, this is why I, I can't get into the debate. I just appreciate art. art. So that's when right. I see something, I'm like, okay, because there's some shit that I'm like, that, yeah. Denzel's doing his Denzel. I was, I was just about to say, like, now nah, this is what media does. Like, wow, he doesn't think Denzel is in his top five. That's crazy. <laughs> <Right. laughs> All the memes is he don't Denzel. fuck with Denzel. Yeah. 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 There's Denzel. like two white people on this shit. But, but that's why like I hate about social media right. because right. this this man just gave a very detailed right. and in depth. And then yeah. you know what they'll take? They'll take a five second clip of him right. not Yo, saying Denzel, right. and now all of a sudden it's a war well, again. Uh, that's just some understand bullshit. Understand the one thing that I really like. I, I the the, mo- the show How to Get Away with Murder, cool show, but great show, cool show. Uh, <laughs> I, I fuck with the show, but her. <laughs> Acting, her delivery, Jesus her vulnerability, her her, I've just seen her, I, her sternness, her I've seen her be how she breaks someone down and then inspires someone in tough love, and then in that one role really made me look the at her same like, nah, guy who you different. said who we were talking about. You seen Law Abiding Citizen? Oh, come on, come on. <laughs> so therefore, Jamie Foxx goes on record saying, "Come on." She's only in the movie for like what three minutes, Facts. four or five minutes. Facts. She got like three. She's scenes. in a scene with him, yep. and he fuck. She eats him alive. She does. The he goes to the director in Video Village and was like, "Hey man, was it bad?" And the director was like, "Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was pretty bad." Like because she's like she doesn't come to fuck around. Like she's coming there. She's not. She doesn't care about if you got a Grammy, this, that, and the other. She is going to eat. That's the only woman who I've seen go toe to toe with Meryl Streep. And like, cause Meryl Streep's a beast. Like I mean, no, Meryl fuck. Is good. I'm yeah, good. like we're not gonna sit here and say she's not that person. She doesn't yeah. deserve what she's she, received. No, she's her. She's her. But she, Viola it? going up there. Have you seen Doubt? 
I, Viola, I come on, on man. I fuck with Viola, man. Like I, Viola only, taps into something that every actor wishes that they could just pull I, from. Bro, and, she can put and, the boogers on command. <laughs> you know that. Not, the the boogers, Viola snot. The boogers is on command. Bro, like, you missed that part. You, you can't oh, tell, bro. You Early. can't tell that woman nothing. Bro, when they say bro. cry, she's like, she you, like she's like, huh, <laughs> boogers. Boogers. <laughs> <It's laughs> like, nah, like boogers. No, but but like. No, no, she's amazing. No, bro, Viola, bro. Yeah, bro. I was, I was gonna, I was gonna throw when you, when you, when you th- talk about Law Abiding Citizen, I Oops. did remember uh, Gerard Butler. Gerard Butler had a couple oh. good Gerard roles a, that made me. But then when I, when I was growing up, I, I Law Abiding Citizen, uh, three hundred and a couple of the, his, uh, this couple is Sparta. Like yeah. his, his, the, a couple of those roles made me like, yo, Gerard Butler's like very. Like from the um, American Gangster. That wasn't him. Yeah. That wasn't him. That wasn't him. Who was that? That I, was Russell Crowe. I get, Russell but Crow. I'm not gonna lie. I get them get confused. My white guys messed up. My bad. Black people get white people confused. To be honest, white people just look the same. I'm gonna tell I you. Don't know. No, 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 no. Because Meryl Streep and Glenn Close. <laughs> uh, no, yeah. I'm gonna tell you this. Like the 45. Uh, have you seen? <laughs> look, have you seen? <laughs> Let's just move over. Have you seen? <laughs> right. He didn't say they all looking like we did. I said we. Said I know it. I'm on BET, <laughs> yeah. but yeah. Look, yeah. Man, uh, this show ain't gonna go forever. I'm on BET. I need to get on that CW ABC. Um, no, but have you? Seen the Batman? Yes. That old terrible ass movie, bro. What? The, you liked it? Colin Farrell playing. He's not even from this country. Oh, Colin Farrell, who played the Penguin. But the movie sucked though. Or you liked it? Real I part. liked it because first of all, I'm a comic kid, gotcha. geek, and I understand what they're trying to do with it. It was mad so, emo though. Like Colin Farrell is. Oh, he killed the Penguin though. Colin Farrell is. Um. You ever seen the Daredevil movie? I, at the first Absolutely. One. He's the only person he's, in the movie that acted good. Yeah, he's the No, villain. for real. The movie was trash. He's the only so one. So Colin Farrell. With him being bullseye? Colin amazing. Farrell, like. Wait, he played Penguin? Bro. And he killed it. And murdered it. Yep. Yes. That's him. Yes. Yeah. No. So. Yes. Watching yes. him. I'm talking like accent. Dick. Everything. The makeup. That makeup deserved like. An you award. Like the movie, though. You're the first I like the movie like because the movie. No, no, I, I like the two. because like the here's the thing. Here's wow. the thing. There's so many people who've played Batman and you gravitate to the one. Like you're 38, so you know I'm Michael Keaton, bro, all day. Right. To so you death. grew up when about. this shit really dropped. Like I would 1989. I was nine years old. So right. you were what? Six, uh, something like that. Five. 1989. I just was born. No, 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 wow. no, no, no. But y'all don't understand what it did. You don't for know the world. because like so, no, 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 no. So I'm not. I'm not trying to. Did you? Did you watch it? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm I'm looking at I'm looking at Colin Farrell and I'm looking at the the, the mm. Batman the, uh, the Penguin's face. In he Batman, killed that yeah. shit. And I'm no, looking at him that. and I'm remembering you know Colin Farrell's action movies and some yeah. of his fun stuff and I'm remembering this person and I'm remembering how he spoke how he. Yeah, mm-hmm. he's, uh, wait, I'm, I'm, remem- I'm remembering he's when the Batman put him yeah. against the wall and and how he's speaking and. Bro, like he's great, like on some shit comments. like some when you played it was like one part in the movie where I was just like they Commissioner Gordon they like interrogating him they show him like a dead body like on a picture and he was like hey what are you showing me here and I'm like nigga you're not even from this country but right. you sound like an old nigga from the Catskills <laughs> like back in the day you I'm like Italian yo right now. Bro, old Italian like, New York yeah, like, yeah. yeah. and yeah. I'm like and he yo got that accent this dude. Like the the thing is to, to I feel like to have become a movie star quote unquote yeah you have to have a package because mm-hmm. there's a lot okay so um what's your man's name uh uh Forrest Whitaker phenomenal actor yeah, beast phenomenal is it him or is it the eye phenomenal <laughs> don't do that I'm don't just do that. phenomenal it's actor just jokes. but is he a movie star. No. no. Me and my friends used my acting friends used to have this this debate about leading man versus what is a leading man? Does a leading man have to be handsome? Does a leading man have to be this? Cuz back in the day like Paul Newman was the shit. Yeah. Like Paul Newman like he could do no wrong. His eyes were like the color of that blue whatever and he could do nothing. 
he he pulled black women, white women, anyone. everybody. Yeah, everybody. Like if your mom saw him and was he was like, "Hey, how you doing?" Dog? She got that. She's going. Yeah. Like, <laughs> so Paul Newman, baby. but he was like, and Guam he Guam happened Guam. to be Guam Guam Polly. Like, to, <laughs> <laughs> stupid. That's stupid. It's almost like okay, really funny comedians <laughs> aren't the most attractive. You feel what I'm saying? Because they pull from something. So, like, the to be a movie star, to be beautiful and right. or handsome and be able to deliver, that's somewhere where you have to take your ego out of it. Right. Like, mm-hmm. you have to take your ego out of being, uh, I can't be the cool kid. I can't be the cool dude in the movie. Mm-hmm. I got to be ugly. I got to be dirty. People think like Viola was people Viola is now getting her flowers but she had to be so good at acting because yeah. in yeah. Hollywood standards she wasn't labeled the most beautiful woman right. but then Facts. when the black empowerment came and she was dope in all the movies right they gave her like oh my god like the show I'm on is sisters there's four five beautiful black women on there I know I really want to talk about that right. so so so, so I right, boom um sisters man we got to talk yeah. about it no we definitely got to talk, talk about it man. All right. um, no but, but more importantly I'm, I'm sorry I'm <laughs> fuck your point <laughs> he did no, he I, did a fuck damn, my point it's all right that's ahead, how bro. it came off I, I, do, I don't want to do that Charlie okay. brothers because so, more so importantly like, it's his point bro I love you you feel I love you hey Dane hey Dane hey Dane what's your point I'm gonna shut the fuck up it doesn't matter go Jay no, but I'm, I'm going to say this, right? Because we've been talking about a whole bunch of other actors and actresses yes. and a whole bunch of other roles and a whole bunch of this and a whole bunch of that. Yeah. I want to really get in tune and tap into, like, what's up with you? Yes. Okay. Right? Like, fuck all the Mount Rushmore's and the <laughs> It's just fun because, like, you know. No, it's cool because we have an insider opinion. We have a professional opinion, and we never have that. We yeah. just be just some niggas talking shit on the couch. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. So we well, find. Y'all are connoisseurs. Y'all look at stuff, and y'all exactly. are viewers, and y'all but opinions. But we not. Like that. I'm a smart motherfucker. Like, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, valid. Smart it's, it's hey, different, hey, it's different hey, when you hey, on the inside. Hey, hey, my nigga, thank you for valuing us <laughs> as connoisseurs. <laughs> I, mean, I, I respect hey, it. Hey, <laughs> I respect hey, it. Hey, hey, hey. You <laughs> <laughs> sound like a poodle. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, bro. I appreciate you, my nigga. That's some real <laughs> shit. I, I, want, I, want to, I want to really tap into... The roles that you've played mm-hmm. and and the role that you're currently in now on TV mm-hmm. that we fucking see. And it's like, is that your role? What do you think your role is? What is Ooh, what is good question. like real shit? Like, like what's like, the role that you want to play? Like what mm-hmm. is yo, this is it, this this is what I this I got into this business for this. I want to give the best the best this that I can. Gotcha. Like what is That's that? I have good a follow question. Question. That's a really good question. Um you two on what? Food too? <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Light skin version. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, sorry. 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 <laughs> 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 That's what you feel. <laughs> yeah, nah. Um, nah, no, no, no. Um, you know, I just want to do good work. I know that sounds like a very PC answer, mm-hmm. but it mm-hmm. is really about the work. There's yeah. there's stuff that you never would have thought you. I never in a million years would have thought I'd be playing this character on this show. Yeah, because he's so different from anything that I've ever done before. Mm-hmm. Okay. So for me, it's like you don't know. But as as I mature and I get older, you run to challenges. Yes, because mm. this was a challenge for me. I was like when. I thought I knew the character, and then Tyler was like, no, nah, that's not it. Mm, it's damn. this. And I was just like, mm. oh. But then the ego and the you got your boys back home, and you live in Atlanta, and how are the people going to perceive you? Right. And this, that, and the other. And then it just became like, bro, once we talked about, we just talked about how those handsome guys, it's very hard for them, the movies, that they always want to play the take your shirt off, dude. Right. And it's yeah. only one note. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But Right. There's nothing you don't want to get gritty because either you can't or you're afraid that that's going to mess with your bottom line. And you've been that dude. You know, I've definitely been the take your shirt off dude. Like you don't care what comes out of my mouth as far as take dialogue. Yeah. It's just the women going to see it, you're going to have a shower scene, you're going to have a sex scene right. and it's like, "Oh my god." And there's the writing usually has no substance to it, so mm-hmm. you can't 
you 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 don't care what so I. So admitting have to say. me, you don't like that. And I'm only asking because I've never had I, an opportunity to ask someone who's done I, that or have. Done well, now I mean it's cool because there's 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 levels. Okay. So like if you're getting in the game, right. like you use what you have to I get in the game. Take my shirt off. Like you know what I'm saying? Like it's like I'm yeah, you take your shirt. Off, yeah, nobody you, wanna see this. <laughs> Yo, I, 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 I. You know what I'm saying? Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I mean, because you nasty. But it's, it's, it's bad work. It's bad work. It's bad work. Is it? Because you nasty. No, I'll be in the shower next door. Like, no, no, this this like, nigga's 6'1", six, no, no. six, hey. I'm college football born. Like, I got muscles. I went to college. Yeah. Nigga. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's great <laughs> timing. Like, That's comedic timing. College. I went to college? <laughs> Steal that hey. right there. Hey. <laughs> I went to college? Don't don't take your shirt off. No, but it's like you. Like you, you can do that though. But yeah, do but you at the same it? time, bro, substance, gotcha. stuff that relates to people. Right. Like everything you do is not going to relate to everybody. Right. Like I didn't know there were real Calvins in the world. Yeah. Like mm. I'm coming from the Midwest. I live in Atlanta. Yeah, where it's you know it's different right. from the Midwest. But when we did the first season. And then I started getting DMs from dudes saying, like, bro, thank you for sharing, like, my story. And I'm like, yeah, and it's like, because I believe that everybody, you can't say that Asians need to be represented, gays need to be represented, blacks, Latina, all these people need to be represented, but we don't want to know about this. Right. So everything has to be on the board. So... The character may not resonate to you or you, right. but, but it so, may yeah. speak to somebody, Absolutely. and that's what art does. Art is you just, and it's your responsibility as an artist to tell that in a truthful manner to where it can resonate with somebody. Okay. So My he bad. preaching right now. So he real preaching shit, right like now. he preaching. For me, I was just like, okay, it's a challenge. I don't know what this is going to do, and then you get to this level of. Fuck what people got to say. Yeah. Your mortgage ain't going to be paid by people's opinions. Ooh! Bro, you've been dropping Ooh. gems all night. You real talk. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you, you know, the thing is, it, it's a challenge. <laughs> and if you're waiting for the industry, there's very few times that the industry will give you a challenge. Mm. They just want to know if you can do the job. And they'll put you, right. in, a and they'll put you in a They'll put you in a situation. There's, That's interesting. There's a lot. Halle Berry. Beautiful. Yes. When she did um, Jungle Fever, she had to dirty herself up, put right. egg in her hair, and not bathe for like a day or two. Yeah. And then she had to show you, I can act. Right. I can go there. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And there's very few people. There's a lot of actors who are like, you're 40, 50 years old, and you're still trying to be to take your shirt off, dude. Right. Mind you, there's a new Michael B. Jordan waiting in the wings, <laughs> right. and he's going to be the new hot shit. You're and you're going to start. Michael B. Yo, and Tyler Perry has all of them. You're not you're, beating you're that. Not, Just, by the way. You're, you're not. not. That nigga. So, but I got to ask you, bro. Mm -hmm. The slap. The two spins. <laughs> the spin? The spin, bro. Stupid. <laughs> I'm so mad at you right now. I'm so sorry. We I, had a great ass dialogue hey, going. Hey, I'm so sorry. Listen, listen, but you have to. We said we wasn't gonna ask you, but I was like, ah, right, we gotta ask. We you. gotta ask her. I mean, we gotta ask you hey, because you, because you, that, you, no, you no, that? You, you, no, 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 no. Stop, stop I, I, asking, I, I, preaching all the questions. I hate all mom and dad. Stop fighting. <laughs> it's Christmas. <laughs> like what the fuck? All right. So even you shared it. It went viral. Obviously, you know what I'm saying. It was the the, and then the the point was the the only funny part about is the scream when the slap. It's like. <laughs> so, yeah, so, that was it. That was it. It's, it's, so it's like it's two things that happened. You spin twice, and, and okay, mm -hmm. was that in the script or did you have lived that? Like, okay, real, so bro? have you been slapped like that before? I just want to hear this. Never. You, you are, bro, this, <laughs> I need you to understand. This is exclusive. So okay, so the thing is, the day we were filming it, uh, shout out first of all, shout out to Sky Black, uh, Brian Jordan Jr. and Novi Brown who were in the scene with gotcha. me. Um, phenomenal actors. So we, we prepare one way. So we don't know what's really in Tyler's head. He gives us our scripts. We make our choices. We okay. do our things. So I'm thinking, once again, going to the, the, the um, what do you call it, uh, backstory of what happened prior to that scene. Right. Mm -hmm. So me and Sky's character, Jacoby, get into it. We have a little standoff at right. Novi's apartment. And it leads into this at the bank. And so I'm thinking, we're, it says we're going to fight. So we work with a stunt coordinator. I get one off. He gets one off. Right. It's, it's a fight. And mm -hmm. then it just ends up going away. So 
or I end up getting knocked out, but it's a fight. Like, it's not like you just going to steal on me yeah, or yeah, whatever. Yeah, no, right? y'all tussled. Yeah. And so we end up starting the scene, and we did it, and we tussled, blah, 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 blah. He hits me. I pass out. So Tyler was like, okay, that was good. He was like, how many times can you spin? He actually asked you that. Yeah, wow. and I was like, wow. hey, what do you mean? Because in the scene, I'm thinking it's it's – Aggressive. It's rooted in truth. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? What I'm not fighting about it. Yeah, real. it's yeah, real. I get it, I get it. So he was like, nah, I need over the top. And I'm like, <laughs> and in my mind, I'm like, why? But you cut the, <laughs> but but you you own the studio, you're directing, you wrote the shit. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so I told him, I said, however many times you need, man. Okay. Yeah. And so he was like, okay, cool. So I remember, once again, I'm I'm a Cinephile. I watch a lot of TV. I watch a lot of films. Mm. And so I remember a scene from um, Fresh Prince of Bel Air when he oh. was dating Nia Long and they got into a fight at the bowling alley. The bowling, the bowling alley. alley. Yep. And so yes. that big ass dude steals him. Like, yes. and, and he's just like. <laughs> right. And right. so that was kind of like the. I was like, all right. But I'm goofy anyway. So right. I'm like, okay, let, if you want me to go over the top, <laughs> go over the, the top. top. Fuck it. All right, so okay. he throws the punch. <laughs> and so it's actually, this is an exclusive. <laughs> so sorry. everybody asking, like, who made the noise? Was it Maurice or was it Calvin? <laughs> it was both of us. Oh, word. <laughs> so it, was, it just got synced up. Like, so it was like when he threw the punch, I'm like, oh. <laughs> And so oh, I that thought, was you too? And yes. I thought that was the girl. That, that was, was, no, it was Brian. Was, it was the dude who plays Maurice. So I spin so I could hear crew like, <laughs> and I hear Tyler like. Mm. So in my, if you look at the scene, I'm turned to the side away from the camera and I'm trying not to like breathe because I'm like, <laughs> so I'm knocked out and Novi's still in it. She's like, Jacoby, get right, out she's still in the scene right yeah. here. Yeah. She's still going. And so I'm in there like, <laughs> so even when I get up, I'm still playing. Like when I wake up, they like, he's like, Calvin, Calvin. Right, and I'm like, jump up and I start punching like. And that's just me being me from okay. like a kid. That's good and acting, so that's I had okay. no idea because the thing was, my mind wasn't even set on that. At the time um, when it went viral, my, when did it go viral? Last year? It was last year. It was like, it was last year. Definitely. So but my it was mother. Everywhere though. Because yeah, niggas was, was like, all yo. Over the place. Yeah, like, so it like, made me watch Sisters. I ain't gonna front. We I were, I've never seen the show before. We were, we were. <laughs> Closing on our house, mm. my wife was pregnant, and my mom had just passed. Oh, so like I, wow. I wasn't in the headspace. But people were hitting me up like, yeah. "Yo, did you see what Snoop Dogg posted? Right, and this, right, that, right. and I'm like, what? Worry about that shit. And I was I like, went to work, I came nah, home, and I life. looked at it, and I'm like, oh. oh. But this was like, that's crazy. It was almost like, okay, even if you know I'm going through all this stuff, like my mom, I feel like my mom was in heaven, like. You want the world to see you. Mm. I'm going to make sure the That's world sees you. Mm. And crazy. so regardless of Thank what God. you think about it, yes, sir. the world saw her baby like doing yeah. what he was doing as a child, Come like being over the top, doing all this stuff. I'm and never gonna cry. so <laughs> bringing enjoyment <laughs> to people's lives. So like, that's the thing. And the people, you know, some people were like, uh, there's one dude, he's a like re, not a reality, but he is a um, influencer okay, or whatever a, that means. I hate that word. Hate he's that a, word. he's an influencer or he he does comedy, but he does skit. But he recorded it and he was like, "This is not acting." And I'll say to him that do your research before you comment on something mm. because Nigga. if you understand. The show, <laughs> got my back. <laughs> if you no, understand the show, like you would know that thing, that was right? what, because to the untrained eye who someone doesn't watch the show, it just looks like over the top act. Yeah, it's, it's, it okay. definitely Clip. looks like over the top you know, act. It's like it doesn't match the. It doesn't match the scene, the scene. because we go from here to, to funny. Yeah, of course. Yeah. And that's what makes Tyler's show unique. It's not a dramedy. It's not a comedy. It's not a drama. It's its own thing. It's something yeah. that's never been on television yeah, like yeah. this. That's what and Tyler so, does. right. He, yeah, I was just about to say, like, even, I, I, All, even yeah. his shows, his shows, like The Oval. Shout out to people on The Oval. I got friends on The Oval. It's a drama. Right. Um, House of Pain. 
My homeboy Lance. That Shout shit out is to Lance. Hilarious. That shit is a comedy, but yes. it has dramatic very, elements. What's very, the joint with very. David Mann? Um, the, the, uh, assistant uh, living now, yeah. and then the yeah, but the Browns, the Browns. comedy. <coughs> no, but but you're right. Meet I'm, the Browns, but our shit is something it totally gets very serious, and then and then comedy. it can go left it, into quick. comedy in yeah. a heartbeat. Yeah. yeah. So for me, it was like when people comment, I'm like, I don't watch this show because that was ex- that would be exactly what Calvin would do. Mm. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. But if you don't watch it, you don't you're know. like, oh, this is some bullshit. This right. is. The, once again, I always play devil's advocate, looking at, oh, you don't watch the show. But if you watch it, you'll probably be like, oh, this dude. Because if you look at everything that Calvin has done, first season he talks about everything from, like, um, how he was raised by two gay white fathers, uh, how he run, you know, when he ran out the hospital when his dad died, all this stuff, and it leads up to this one. Yeah, that's what he was, you, you, you know, know what I'm saying? You know what's funny, though? Mm-hmm. And and this is what I hate to be the guy that brings race into it. I, I, I no, do it. I do. I hate to be that guy. But what happens is when a franchise is known for for building a world or a universe, we allow them to do that, mm. right? We mm. allow them. Mm. If, if you're talking about Star Wars, Star Trek, we allow them the character d- development. We allow them to have the likes day. No, no, bro. We got this, bro. (laughs) Appreciate it. We're good. We allow we we allow (laughs) them to have all that shit, but when it comes to us and our people, we're not allowed to have the the development of the characters. We're not allowed to have the the over quote unquote reaction of a character. We're not allowed to have any of that because that's not. Well, it doesn't subscribe to a like, specific formula that we are known to. No, but 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 that's what gets me upset because what, what I'm saying is, right. if if we can allow fucking Harry Potter to go off and do whatever and, and experiment and branch off and do this and do that, we're now here talking about Tyler Perry and the character that you 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 had you was in the situation. He was like, okay, I'm gonna do this because of whatever's happening in my life, and we're gonna move this way we don't give you the grace to do that right yeah, mm. like mm. the the grace is never given for us to do that to but the grace is given for them they can do whatever Facts. they want so, Facts. Um, mm. to, to, the grace is there they can they can manifest whatever role Facts. or whatever characters or whatever side characters side plots mm. anything can happen they can have 13 different spin-offs right I, I would, but we're not given that same, and, and that's that's what pisses me off. I feel you. So the jump, because there's, there's there's so many. I'm, I know I keep talking. I'm yeah, sorry. No, no, because you like you like you pause. <laughs> no way. Like, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, like, okay, like, no, like, you, like, you like, like so you pause, it. and hey, I thought hey. you were done. But it's okay, like the worst, <laughs> this is the worst cipher ever. Like, <laughs> he double dutch it. But I, I just want to say <laughs> in conclusion. I just want to say in conclusion. <laughs> it, it it pisses me off. Well, I think no, I'm joking. It's stupid. <laughs> like it pisses me off when we're not afforded that same opportunity. It's like we have the talent, we have the writing, we have yeah. the acting ability, we have all that. Let us develop. Let us portray what we want to portray, so we can have everything that y'all that, quote that, unquote that, have on the ugh. other side. It's like it's, it's, yeah. that shit yeah. pisses me okay. off. So like I, that shit pisses me us. off. I don't. I don't necessarily like. I, just, I don't like the let us part. You, uh, no, you're no, right. No, no. I don't like that part. Yeah, but, I got you. So I. With that, when you say let us, I don't think that, which, which, are you just yes or no question? Yes. Um, well, either or question. Are you talking yes. to the general audience, which is more, pow- which is powered mainly by the white audience? Or are we talking to the black audience directly? Just to, before I give what I'm about to give. Because what your, your answer, regardless of what it is, is going to power my statement. I'm, I'm, I'm more so Who are you speaking-, speaking to. I'm, I'm more so speaking to the, the people in power that puts on the productions, okay. to be mm-hmm. honest. So with that being said, I think um, I think that the consumer, right? I think the audience many times, you know, is, of course it depends on the, the, the politics of the situation. Mm. But I definitely think that the, the audience has a say on what we desire, what we see for a particular person, mm-hmm. right? So, for example, um, 
I know a lot of people were very struck when Kevin Hart decided to do a very serious role with the with the. The him and Wesley Snipes thing that was, was good. I read that for that. Good. Huh? That shit was. Funny. I read for yeah, that. Yo, that, that was so you read for shit. It? Yeah, I read yeah. for the bodyguard. Wait, was you going? Oh, so, I was going to ask who he was going to be. I read for it, so, but I, that what, dude killed it. But but ah. that that was a that was great. And when people, I know when people, certain people saw it, they immediately was like, "Kev is really doing a serious." Yeah. But that's not his niche. Yeah. yeah. But the culture that follows Kev absorb you know absorbs what he does. Welcomed it, appreciated it, and it was like, "Wow, he does this." He and he it. said it, and 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 valued him in doing that. Yeah. Right? So I think that when it comes to that, when people do different things, many times when we see him do it, if we're not, we if we don't have an open mind, we be like, "Yo, that's not you. I don't, I don't even want to see you doing nothing like that." And then we I, throw I them can back. Agree there. We throw them back into okay. whatever box we feel like they belong. Mm. I, I I think that yes, it is politics. Yes. But I definitely believe that it's really about the consumer at the end of the day because the people that's making the whatever production really just want to get to a check. Yeah, can I just retort uh, real quick? Go ahead. Because this is deep. And, um, you know I get deep. That's what she said. Um, wait, what? Um, <laughs> Stupid as shit. I fuck, I fuck hate y'all. <laughs> I hate all y'all niggas. <laughs> really, uh, a really serious, <laughs> very, very well thought out statement ended with that, right? Yeah, yeah. she died. Yeah, that's what she said. Like, what? <laughs> like yo, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I gotta fuck. What? <laughs> Welcome to Willow Wednesday. <laughs> what? That's what um, you're doing. No, that's no, but, but I also, um, I think that uh, we don't control it. And that's the problem. So when you say the let us part, that's what I was speaking of. Like, yeah. Speaking of Tyler, since he decided to control it and take control and build his own market, opinion or not, fuck what you want to say. That nigga's a genius. Yeah. <laughs> and he's creating shit the way he wants to, period. What is the universe? Well, the thing Just is... And, Marvel has no, no, but, but, but... He has had this thumb. But no one else... It's, it's almost like... It's okay. Black people don't talk about going to space. For, like we just don't fuck with space because we got too much shit going on in Brooklyn, too much we, shit in Atlanta. Like yeah. we just, they don't fuck with us in America. You know what I'm Why do we care about space? Exactly. <laughs> this but, is facts. No, no. This is that, facts. So life is hard on us, facts. right? But but what if we wanted to go to space and like build our universe on space? Black people, we can. We just don't. And, a, and I don't think the market dictates it. You, you, the consumer. I don't think the market dictates it. I I'm, think the people in power dictate it. I'm gonna tell you this: people don't know what they want until you give it to them. Facts. So, come on. Here's now. the thing. Shit, a new you said, drop every week because they said so. You <laughs> said that we don't fuck with space because no one has ever, no one that looked like us has ever done anything right. and showed you a certain space. thing about space. Mm -hmm. We are the tastemakers. We are the people. I'm sorry. White people don't know what's cool until we tell you it's cool. That's facts. A hundred percent. thousand percent. There's not, <laughs> there's not a sneaker or a soft drink that gets sold in this country without black influence. Period. So you're not going to play a Kenny Chesney song list for a Nike shoe. No, you're going to play Migos. You're going to play Migos. You're going to play Future. You're going to play this. Yep. We are the, the culture. The culture. <laughs> There's no if let me tell you something. And I mean, I'm not I love everybody. My mom taught me to love everybody, but I Shout love mom, I bro. love my culture. And I understand like if my man tells me, "Yo, those those kicks are fire." I'm, there's a pride that sticks up to me. Mm -hmm. If a dude who's wearing Skechers, a white dude comes up to me with his with his t-shirt tucked in his jeans, and he's like, those are some cool shoes. I'm probably going to probably throw these shits in the trash. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, yeah, you like these? Because God. That's Damn. what I'm saying. Be <laughs> because here's the thing. I'm we are, not, yeah. we are, we tell people what's cool. We just don't get paid for it. That's it. We tell people what's cool. We've been, we've we don't we get paid it? for it. Okay, so it, can we talk about? Been a great guest, fam. So <laughs> no, real <laughs> shit. Talk about it. real shit. Yeah. We we tell people. Yeah. There's nothing like okay. You tell me one of your favorite, like the biggest white artists. I'll give you five black artists that are like killing them. Bing. Music, <laughs> film, Bing. anything. Only or, thing, or, or, but or the inspiration. Exactly. The so Bing. when we say okay, Tyler didn't. People were saying, oh, your plays, your plays. His, his shit was built off of plays. Right. Then he was like, I want to do films. Or I want to do, do movies. The Jimmy Fox uh, path. 
Yeah, I want to do. I want to do television. So he did television. His right. show. First of all, people got to realize House of Pain was the first show of its kind to get a hundred episodes guaranteed. You know what that means? That's syndication off rip. Exactly. So whereas the blueprint of Hollywood is, I shoot a pilot, I test the pilot, I see how it goes Sharp. with some people that probably don't even right. fucking relate to this content but they'll let's try it then they see the ratings and see what happens the ratings could have tanked on house of pain but guess what those people are going to be working for 100 episodes regardless of these ratings are ass that's unprecedented even when he went to other networks they were saying well no that's unheard of that's unheard of tbs was like shit we'll take it and he mm. ran with TBS. Mm. Same as when with OWN. Mm. He had his deal with OWN. Then Viacom came a knocking, was like, yo, mm. you know how many networks Viacom owns? They own the country music yeah, station, Viacom Nickelodeon, BET, <laughs> all Everything. the BETs, MTVs. Everything. So he could put his stuff in more and then that where you can build more content. So you can do dramas, you can do comedies, you can yeah. do Young Dylan, you which is on Nickelodeon. Universe, you can right. build it. So therefore, people don't know what they want until you give it to them. Yeah, we don't fuck with space because you've never seen a nigga in space. Mm. You didn't know. What's the dude, uh, John Boyega? He yeah. was in Star Wars. In Star Wars. You didn't yeah. know. You know how many people fuck with Star Wars regardless of who's under the, the, the helmet? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. The In fact, you don't know how many people is under the helmets. The world. You don't know who's yeah. under the helmets. You don't give a shit. Just like superheroes. Terrence Howard pl was supposed to play War Machine. War Machine they swapped that nigga out for, very, very cool. for uh, what's it, Don Cheadle. My and nigga. guess what? Nobody has had a petition or anything right. about that shit. It's <laughs> a super, it's a superhero <laughs> like movie. Period. How can you just replace War Machine? No, we you don't do care. Movie. You don't we care because do you something. care more about the content than you do about the person the who's in it. Yes. So therefore, when we show some shit to people, you didn't know. I honestly, I'm gonna be a hundred. I didn't know. I've had shows and I've had shows that didn't go, and I'm like, fuck that shit. I thought it was gonna be a hit. Right. The cast, they're a younger cast. I'm the oldest on the cast, right? Everybody is Everybody young, but they're all exciting. Like they were all. I was like, what was I? Thirty? I wasn't even. I was like thirty-eight. No, we. 39, 39, and everybody was younger than me. So I was like... I know everybody at home got the same face I got on. Yeah, what? That? The oldest person. Yeah. You look great. Thank you, sir. No, no he does. Sir. I appreciate he's it. Great, well, I'm going to stop drinking this because <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah, looking yeah. around. Yeah. And, no, no, I'm just fucking... <laughs> <laughs> we're not just going to be drunk. Uh, <laughs> fuck around with us. Y'all do this every Tuesday? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, let me get the fuck up out of here. No, no, no. no. Y'all not bringing my life. <laughs> well, honestly, hey, hey. Yo, you are, yo, bro. Honestly, I'm going to tell you this hey, right now, man. Alkaline. You alkaline. Like, alkaline. Alkaline water like a motherfucker. Alkaline. <laughs> y'all do this every week? Because y'all niggas look like play. No, no, but Grizzled. I, no, but I do. I do. I, honestly, y'all look great, man. I do want to thank you for coming out, man. I appreciate um, it. Man. I appreciate it. We, I'm pretty, nigga, you been amazing guys bro i appreciate no, no, it real facts, real facts. some real, real shit facts, real like, facts, been an amazing i appreciate that guys, man, man. What, so what's your future like plans like what you what you know like if you can do a time capsule type shit what, what do you can, see can, can i piggyback off of that no that was mean? a great question they all point at no, what I'm, you talking about no, i got some no, shit this I'm is gonna, twice i'm gonna enhance the question because i love that question yes i'm I love the after he says something, man. You gonna add you throw some, some peppers on it. So I love the the, the base of that question. <laughs> I, I want I want to follow up with all right. Um, not only are you an actor, but you're a producer. Yes, mm -hmm. right. So, um, with, with the production, what do you see for yourself? It's like like we we talking with the the whole Tyler Perry we world. We keep making and, these and, long but, questions. It's not a long question. It's it's. Gonna add some more to it. He literally he, was he, talking for 20 seconds. <laughs> like, it's long as shit. It's trying to get out of here. My Waffle bad. House. I don't know. Is <laughs> Waffle House around? Wait, I, I'm not gonna hold you. No, you good, bro. Can I say something that may be blasphemous? 
I don't fuck with the Waffle House down here. Hey, bro, 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 cool. I don't know. I'm not on your side. I'm not on your side. I'm not on your side. That's what you get. That is instant fucking karma, nigga. Let's go. That's the equivalent. That's not let's go. That's the equivalent of saying the B word, okay? I just want to let you know. That's Waffle House whooping your ass. Waffle House is disgusting. Fuck, I didn't even say that. It's nasty. All right, wait, no. Let's go. Waffle House is nasty. Waffle House is a delicious place between the hours of 12. P.A.M. and 6 a.m. That's where I'm from, Waffle House is like on the side of the road where like truck stops. Thank you. Well, it's nasty But I mean, food. I get it. I mean, no, no, it's no. a staple. You know, Waffle House is like, it's like two bros. Guys, guys you only nasty. have you go to two hours bro- to eat Waffle House. That's it. If you eat Waffle House in between those six hours, you are making a choice. Nope. <laughs> it was the dejection <laughs> of you looking down at this puddle that you've created. <laughs> and that's hilarious. He's looked at it while <laughs> he was talking. <laughs> he was like, I'm hearing you, but... I'm so mad. I'm so I, mad but right now. Like, but check it out. I'm so mad so, right now. Can we Anthony, get back to Anthony, Anthony yeah. so we can just want to know, get, talk to us, man, about your, what's your five to ten year projection Whoa. of your career? God can you, damn. Can you, can, you, can you guys just hold it down? Thing? Well, I'll be what's 87. Your, I'm just <laughs> <playing. laughs> yeah, like, I'll be 100. Oh, my God. What's your Everything's five? happening right now, <laughs> and it's, it. so, it's time to leap. So, Anthony, what's your five to ten year projection when it comes to your 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 roles that you're playing and your producer you're producing? Tell me, what do you see? Honestly, bro, the biggest role that I'm really focused on now is being a dad, man. Mm. Nice. Like, real I talk. I fucking love um, that. Nice. Like, I fucking love that. It, as an artist, you are, especially getting into this business young, you are selfish. And rightfully so, because mm-hmm. to pursue your dreams, you have to be selfish with, the, with even telling your dream to anybody. Right? right? So... Everything is about you. Like I told you, I didn't go to strip clubs. I didn't hang out. I didn't. I was either in an acting class or something that I was doing an independent film, a yeah. play, something sure. to to because I didn't want to. Okay, guys, you moved me here. Now I'm a fuck off I'm a fuck when I when I get here. No, I was like on my shit, so I could afford to be selfish. Being a husband and a father right now. Paramount's everything. Paramount Plus. Password, by the way. Like, Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> I got the password. I got the password. Yeah, you, I'm fucking a password. But no, no, Paramount's like it, 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 it trumps everything because right. I feel if I master those, everything else will, will fall into place. When I master my household and I master being a dad and I'm still going to keep learning how to be a good father, mm. the main thing is I'm there with my son Mm -hmm. that's the thing that i'm like no regardless of anything that's happening i'm there he is priority number one son is mad fly by the way appreciate it if you guys go on if you guys go on uh on uh, this gentleman's Love Instagram, <laughs> you will be ashamed of your closet because this Nami Dill baby is shitting on you, okay? Wow. Can, no, he walk? can he walk? Can he not walk? Yet. He's not yet. He's trying, to, he's trying his, to do a lot of stuff, but he can't feet, walk him. His shoes one, two, will forever little... be fresh, okay? Yeah, man. Okay? Uh, I'm sorry. Go but, uh, no, nah, I appreciate that, bro. Um, but, yeah, everything else will fall into place. Um, I, I don't believe that God brought me this far and mm. have has given me all of these blessings to to just leave me. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. He blessed me. It's like when my mother transitioned, I was listening to Snoop Dogg's interview on Drink Champs, and he was talking about how when his mother passed, and he said, my mother did her job. Mm. Now the rest is up to me. Our parents mm-hmm. instill in us what we're supposed to do mm. with this life that we have. And it's up to us to make the most out of it. And I'd be damned if my mother's hard work is in vain. Mm. So my father, I, he was my, he's my father, but he, when he died a year before my mother passed. And mm. also my son is born on the same day that he passed. Wow. Um, yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. That so, That's but crazy. he was around, but he wasn't like the active father. Yeah. And my mother used to tell me, when you have your son, you know what you didn't have. So you will give your child everything that you mm-hmm. didn't have. That's mm-hmm. what, you know that, what I'm that saying? You wanted. That you wanted. Yeah. And so that is my main goal. Like, I got an audition tomorrow, and I don't stress Oh, shit, are we fucking of, up? No. Okay. No. The, but I don't. No. I'm I mean, just I mean, we're like two in the morning. It's 
It's fucked. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to fuck. Oh, I'm fucking up. It's my bad. It's <laughs> 5 a.m. I don't want to fuck the bad. No, 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 for real. I I wanna, and here's the thing about it. I want to see a post tomorrow. Like, I ain't get it. It's like, oh, no, 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 no. nigga, here's we are. We did that. Break, <laughs> no, no, no. It's not that. Here's the thing. It is when you said, oh, I don't want to fuck up the bag. You, you can't mm. because Somebody I'm free doesn't. with when. As long my priorities have shifted, right. I still do my shit. I still of work course. hard and I still yeah. grind. Mm-hmm. But also, too, I know once again, if I take care of home, everything mm. else will be I was, will be mm, good. You know what I'm saying? Mean. So like, yeah. and I never lose a job. Right. I don't lose a job. I I just don't get it. And whoever books this job that I'm auditioning for, if it's me or if it's anyone, that was in the cards for me or that was in the cards for, for them. them. And right. I leave it alone. The, sh- the ship ain't going to stop sailing. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Like, I'm still going to be doing my thing. But I know my son needs me. Mm-hmm. My wife mm-hmm. needs me. Mm-hmm. My household needs me. I have created an infrastructure for my family that... I didn't come from, mm-hmm. you know, my, I just purchased my first house and it's in a very exclusive neighborhood for okay. somebody who hasn't, you know, who didn't grow up in with the means. Bag so I've talk. So I've won already and it's not even a flex. And I bought the house because of. We're definitely flexing on you. To, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's I, no, flex. No, like, oh, I, no, I bought <laughs> yeah. the house because as not only as because I wanted my family to be like, but I wanted to encourage the kids that are in my family that mm. you ain't got to run with a football. You ain't got to sell dope. Yeah. You ain't got to do this. I'm just like you. I'm from the same bloodline. Mm-hmm. When I taught at high school, mm-hmm. quick story, when I was teaching at my old high school, mm-hmm. the principal actually, when I was about to leave to come to Atlanta, the principal actually told me, he said, we want to offer you the, the head of the theater program. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, okay, cool. Now, mind you, I'm broke as shit. Like, that would have been like good money. Okay, but I was right now. Yeah. <laughs> like, shit, listen, I'm I come shit, to be I candies to the left. <laughs> candies. <laughs> candies. <laughs> yeah, I do it. Fuck you. Like, yeah. Yo, bro. But like, I got it. Real shit though. Candies. But he offered I'm me. I'm in retail. Nigga. He he he. <laughs> he, <laughs> he, <laughs> he <laughs> I'm in retail. I sell phones. He's but he said, "I'll give you this," and I looked at him and I said. How long have you been in education? He said, over 30 years. I oh. said, well, I said, you've been telling these children the same things. Pull up your pants. Treat your uh, adults with respect. Right. Treat others with respect. Mm-hmm. I said, you've done this for so long. Yeah. I said, but if Lil Wayne walked in here right now and said the same shit that you said, it's going it would hard. impact them more than you all more. your 30 years. Wow. I said, if I go out and achieve what I'm supposed to achieve, mm. and I come back. You'll be that voice. I'm that voice. So I've trumped being a teacher. Yeah. Mm. I'm more of a mentor. I'm more of a, I don't even want to say icon to them, but that they're looking at it because lot they come from the same neighborhoods that I come from. I mean, I'm not special. You, I just have persistence, and I have a drive, bro, and I keep going. You mentoring us right now. Like, <laughs> shit. This whole show. So shit. So I've been trying to throw you off your game. He cannot get thrown off. I have, one more, <laughs> I have a specific question for you. So um, I do want to bring in uh, age into it. Okay. 41 years old. You look like you could run very fast. <laughs> then all the <laughs> Um, yeah, I run. <laughs> nigga said, in the foot race, he's fucking us all. Nigga said, thank you. He's like, I don't want to see you. I want to see you in the foot race. Bro. Nigga said, I'm glad you noticed. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, some so, money so, on the table. We can take it to the parking lot. So I don't um, even got money to put on the table. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, but look, you will. You will. You, you will. will. You will. All y'all will because I'm gonna tell so, you this real look, quick. I mean, before you know, I know I'm the guest. Fuck your question. No, I know I'm the guest, but yo, this. Yes, bro, you I'm a type of person where I see like on Tokyo like shit. I see shit. <laughs> like I remember when I first saw Paper Soldiers. Mm, uh-huh. I told my niggas in college, I said, that nigga Kevin Hart's gonna be a star. Right, great. I definitely told him that. Yeah. I mean, guess what? I'm the Kevin Hart. Oh, so, no, no, no. No, I'm the Kevin Hart. No, but that's not what he's saying. That's not what he's saying. 
side. That was funny. For the, the way that y'all, I call this what I'm what I'm witnessing now mm -hmm. is organized chaos and it's beautiful. All right, that's the end of the motherfucking no, 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 show. No, 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 you, Are you serious? Just finish. No, you, just, you no. explain Hold what- on. We're, 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 gonna, this, we're gonna jump on that. Yes, yeah, this is <laughs> organized <laughs> chaos from my entrepreneurs out there. And I'm gonna tell you this. Okay, my dude. It, oh, God. No, just for calling it. That, no. Hold on, then, no, wait, wait, wait. No, it, 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 it is because the professionalism, but the relaxation of just being y'all. People don't understand being authentic does not mean faking the funk. It means being you 100%. Talk to him. Talk that Talk shit, to him. bro. Shout out to, Talk to him. <laughs> my, my, my brother back home from Naptown, Mike Epps. Naptown. I call him the king of the city. Yes. No, Mike Epps. Mike yes. Epps has been 100% himself the throughout whole this whole time. thing. And 100%. so you can't say he switched up or changed. Yeah. And so know. therefore he's getting what he's getting because he is who it is. You know who he is. He yes. can look himself in the mirror and say, I didn't have to kiss my ass. These I motherfuckers knew who I was before when I yeah, came I in, and true. I'm still the same. That's what I see. People like this shit right here mm -hmm. will grow. Because mm -hmm. I'm gonna speak life into y'all. It will grow and it will be bigger and it will be better. And what will happen is what I warn you all is people will try to maneuver you. Mm -hmm. They will try to make you all something into this. That's why they have focus groups. They mm -hmm. have people who don't relate to the content, to the, mm -hmm. to the audience that you all are attracting. Mm -hmm. And what will happen is they're trying to get you into a broader, it's like that episode of Martin when they try to make him. Make him white. Yeah. 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 yeah the glasses on. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Yeah. And yeah. the Jesus fact is, is, is people don't know what they want <laughs> until you give it to them. So the oh, fact man. that y'all are doing this and it's just free and it's y'all gonna get bigger guests and y'all gonna get y'all gonna y'all gonna be names. I can see it, bro. You see so, it. I see it. Bro, you like, don't understand. Shit. You don't understand. Number one, you don't understand what you did to um, our our reinsurance as a as a group. I really appreciate that. Because um, if exactly. we were not our, we we had a, a very strong discussion in the past week mm -hmm. and that narrative that goal is what pushed the discussion when we came to a conclusion of saying this is what what the goal was from the beginning so the Absolutely. fact that you see that off rip is a very big deal Mind and, you, we're, we're um, all not from here just like you right yeah we all came here right to, to make to do the same yeah. thing yeah you know what i'm saying yeah. justin included yeah we're all here so like that's why like it's amazing to like link with people and like you say i agree reassurance my bad i cut you so, off so my, your point? my only question um <laughs> thank you honey <laughs> um, <so> Annoying. <laughs> my, only, my only question uh, the six is, is, is when, when <laughs> well because you spilled your drink. See how it's going. Keep those droplets. Keep those droplets on that side. <laughs> so so listen. So um, your jeans. The reason why I brought up your age is that Must when you leg, what is whenever I, I there are a couple entrepreneurs in the city that I really follow. Um, wow. The circle of CEOs. The Neil Davises, the the Justin Owens, the the the, the people who I really look up to in the city, and I look at their their age of success mm -hmm. or the, the age that they aspire, and when I look at that, look at what they've tried to do beforehand. Right. You know what I'm saying, and as being a, a up and coming person as we all are, just trying to figure it out, right. I feel like no matter what age you are at, when you look at your life, and sometimes if you're not where you want to be, you're like, yo, la la, I'm not here, I'm discouraged. When did you, or what age did you find, feel like you found a glimpse of success, or you felt accomplished? And then when did you realize, yo, realize I'm actually on my way doing my thing? Because I feel like those are two different points. Well, when I first started acting, I had to realize like I knew it wasn't going to be overnight. Like my acting teacher told me in college, Susan Spears, she said it takes 10 yeah, years Susan. to make an overnight yeah. success. Facts. Yeah. And my arrogant ass was like, you got me fucked up. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and that bro, might take you. Know I mean? Because I'm, you're right, because I'm looking What's at- wrong with this I'm, nigga, bro? I'm, No, I'm looking at the people that were in the theater. Like, I'm like, 
I play ball. I'm multifaceted. I, I play ball. I'm, I'm, I can, y'all were theater geeks. Y'all, I mean, shout out to them, but yeah, they were I like, look good. Hey, man. Like, <laughs> but like, <laughs> but on some real shit, I was like, I'm more personable with people. I can do this and do, right. I can do other things. Y'all are just in one lane. And I'm like, nah, y'all got me fucked up. 10 years, literally. Mm. I came out of college in 2008. 2018, 16, 18, mm-hmm. was around like where I started getting like bookings. Yeah. And I was like, God damn it, Susan. Right. <laughs> Susan. 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 Susan again. Shit. Yeah. But yeah, right. also, I understood I may have, are you content with you may have a career like Morgan Freeman? Morgan Freeman oh. didn't become Morgan Freeman, so he was like, Wow. Same thing with Samuel Jackson. Exactly. Samuel Jackson, the, the both of them was over 40 when exactly. they started. So that's what like I'm saying. Moving one. So yeah. you you cannot put a time limit on your blessings. Right. Because there's a lot of people out here who will do this. I'll tell you what they'll do. They'll be like, man, look, I ain't on by the time I'm 33. Mm-hmm. I'm done. Well, God may have given you your big break when you were 33 in a day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or 34. Whatever. 37. And 37. Yeah. What? Yeah. But you willing, I right. say the people that make it are the ones that are willing to wait in line the longest. Come on now. And Ooh. when you. The jewels that they're trying to make. That's no. a fucking joke. Because people will get up the there and put a time now. limit on there. And I'm just like, and also they don't realize that's a slap in the face to God. Who the hell are you gonna tell God to tell you when you right. when I'm when I'm ready okay. to when you right. when you ready? You don't know when you ready. Uh, hell, I know I couldn't have had a number one show at 25. You know how many strippers would have known my name in this fucking <laughs> city? No, no, you're no, fucking facts. right. You're yeah. fucking right. You're fucking Imagine right. Imagine we oh, you're right. right. You get the fuck out of here. No, like, what? no. No, you're right. What church you preach at, bro? Because this is really good. No, it's right just now. it's wow. just life, bro. Like real talk. I know myself. I know who. I know where my blessings come from, mm-hmm. and I like I want to see others succeed. Mm. What you eat don't make me shit. I still want you to succeed. I've just met you today. I still want to see you succeed because I I'm I'm a cancer, so I pick up on vibes. I pick up on people's energy. Right. Y'all not pretentious niggas like oh I'm an industry nigga or yeah. oh this nigga on the show, so I gotta act like I'm. No, y'all niggas, it's just three brothers who actually like hanging with each other, yeah. I think. Uh, and nah, just yeah, like, no, 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 you're right. We're actual yeah, friends. Right. Brothers. Right. So, like, yeah. Yeah. No blows. But, but, facts. but that's the thing. I want to see everyone win. And it, and if I can, one of the biggest crimes is having knowledge and not sharing. It with mm. Because you can prevent a lot of shit. Think about how many niggas is in the penitentiary right now because somebody had the knowledge to be like, yo, brother, don't go down. And didn't share and it. And didn't share it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> to where, you know, I'm in a position now to where I can help people. You need a couple of dollars. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think we all should uh, agree. And I, uh, a collective. When you say I paid to come on y'all <laughs> My nigga, you had this all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. Hey, you had hey, this all yo. the time. Hey, listen, listen, listen. Yo, yo. Thank y'all so Thank y'all so much for watching, yo, man. Yo, we appreciate <laughs> <this> shit. <laughs> we, we appreciate y'all. This nigga like pulled out a cup holder at the last. Listen. This hey, nigga pulled out a magical cup holder. <laughs> Boom. How you feel? You feel great. That, that nigga feel safe. The fuck you talking about? Coming back tomorrow. He feels dry. <laughs> he feels dry. Hey, yo, yo. Thank y'all very yo, much for tuning in. Bring it home. Thank bring y'all very much for tuning in to Will and Wednesday. Appreciate Anthony you. Anthony Dawson, man. Thank you so much. The brother. second, nigga. The motherfucking second. Come on now. Listen, listen, listen. 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 It's been a great combo, fam. Seriously. We really, we really, yes. really appreciate you, We do you, man. appreciate you, you, man, for real. You gave a lot of gems. You yes, gave a man. lot of realness. Gems. You gave yes, a man. lot of insight. Yes. And it has done nothing but re-energize us. And I know when the people at home, when they view this uh, episode, they're going to really see the spectrum. Yes. They're going to see the spectrum of, of, of us as a collective of brothers. They're going to yeah. see the spectrum and the transparency of what I would call a real talented um, on his way, brother. Nah, you know for real. So, so two. And I'm on the next okay. episode of Sisters, nigga. So, oh, oh, shit. Shit. I'm it, hey, bro. Listen, hey, I'm trying to let you know. Then go be one of the sisters. <laughs> <laughs>
Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning in to Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.